for your life and your family's life, you have to be a slave owner back in the days. Oh, my God. Slave owner for five years. Five years? Yeah. Back, and then you come back. It depends what what what, 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 what type. Uh, you are I could in, be a good slaver. But that's what I'm saying. Would you do it? Yeah. Would you buy they Would you buy they freedom? Yeah. What if it's bread though? What if what? What if like what if like all your slaves' freedom is like how much is in your pocket? Oh shit! <laughs> but do you we need to keep some? <laughs> You looking at a twerk video? bro. You looking at a twerk video? Wait, no. Yo, okay. So, I went on my message, and it was your shit. I'm like, wait, what is this? What shit? This video, bro. You fucking piss me <laughs> off, bro. Nah, because so it was. It was like it showed like it wasn't. It wasn't. It wasn't this. It wasn't this. It showed the guy. I'm like, wait, what video is this? And I press it again, and then it's, I forgot <laughs> you're the one who fucking sent me that shit, bro. Oh, yeah, I'm about uh, to put it up if you guys want to see what Fritz was looking at. Wait, we on, bro? Yeah. You weird, bro. What do you mean we weird? Nah, as soon as we start the podcast, that's what I was like, you listen, you watching twerk videos? Nah. He was watching twerk videos. Nah, I was watching a video that, that there's of what? sent me, bro. Of what? So, yo, of what? Hey. You want me to expose no, no. you hey, while bro. you sending me this shit? Fritz liked it. You're weird, bro. Don't, <laughs> don't, don't, don't put that on me, Welcome bro. back to another episode of No Regulars Podcast, episode number 111. I'm your host, DW. I got my co-host, Fritz, here with me. You, you know see, what I'm saying? You see. Nah, I'm Darius today, bro. Oh, yeah. I forgot. I am Fritz Williams. Yeah. I'm Dar- Darius Watkins. <laughs> Latrell Watkins. There's Latrell Watkins. You know, I play basketball. <laughs> basketball. <laughs> I said that shit like a cushion. I play basketball. I play basketball. I play bro. basketball. Like what the fuck, bro? For Rutgers, man. If you, you like the the decor, you know, happy Halloween, people. If you're watching this, it's probably the day, a couple days before Halloween. But comment your costume down below if you celebrate Halloween. If not, fuck the devil. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Type shit. Happy Halloween, y'all niggas, man. Type Tell shit. me what y'all niggas. If y'all niggas dressing up, if y'all niggas. I don't know if y'all too old to trick or treat, but if y'all, I don't think nobody's out. too old to trick or treat, honestly. Nah, you are. <laughs> Why? <laughs> we are. <laughs> if I pulled up trick or treating, that was weird. Yeah. How weird? Pretty weird. Like if I, what if I was with like my little cousin? No. If you're with, if you're around kids, like Paul, if you, if you're <laughs> like, if you're like with kids with your siblings and shit, your younger siblings. Yeah. Yeah, you could trick or treat all you want, but. If you by yourself, bro, <laughs> at so, our age, yeah. So if I'm with little kids, but I go up there and get some candy too. Damn, is that bad? <laughs> Type shit. Why? That's not that bad. I don't bad. know. I don't know. If you go up there and get, nah, it's not that bad. Free That's candy. Cool. That's cool. Yeah. I, I was talking about this with Corey. So what age do you think is like a time we should stop trick or treating? What age do you think it would be? Cool, 22, 21. 22, 21? Oh, that's not that bad. That's not, that's pretty, that's pretty, that's pretty old. That is pretty old. That's not too bad, though. But I'm being nice. You're being nice? Yeah, but I think 21, yeah, 20. Like, say, like, say someone pulled up to your crib, like, say, trick or treat. What's, like, an age they look at, you look at my, yo, you're bugging right now. Shit. That's, that's, like, a better question. Probably, like, yeah, probably, like. If I ask a nigga, yo, how old are you? They can tell me. 25? Nah. Nah. Oh, wait, wait. 25, you're bugging. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 25, you're bugging. But I'm going to be like, I'm going to be like, ah, 20. Like, if he if he hits me with like the 20, 20, 21 years old, then I'll be like, yeah, bro, you should be at like a party right now, bro. Hey, at a Halloween party. Maybe you don't like doing that. I would if, think he's a killer, though. If you don't like doing that shit, then that's cool. Okay. But I would think, he, nah, I would think he's a, if he was by himself, like it's a nigga, he's like, he got a beard and shit. I would think he's like a creep, like yeah. a pedophile. I ain't gonna yeah, lie. Yeah, exactly. Like, he's just creeping on the kids. I'll, 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 I'm a, would you call the cop? Nah. Nah, nah I, would, I wouldn't call it. I'll be cops. suspicious, though. But I'll be, I'll be a little, yeah, I'll be a little suspicious. I'll call my neighbors, tell them like there's a nigga like walking around, like keep an eye on this motherfucker. fuck you wouldn't. What do you mean? I call Gi- you I tell name. Gideon, bro. For real? I tell Gideon. I'll be like, yo. Gideon yo. lives right next to you? Yeah, Gideon lives right there. Yeah, you guys haven't noticed? Gideon literally lives right there. Like, that house right there. <laughs> Are you serious? I've never seen him. I mean, he'd be inside, and like he'd be working a lot. Oh, okay. Yeah. Really? Even when we was in high school? I thought I told y'all niggas. 
Uh, yeah, I didn't know hey, that. Hey, if you're watching this, we'll shout out to you, him. man. Shout out to Type shit. But I got a lot of stuff to talk about. There's a lot of shit that's been going on around the world. Like so, what? Dwight Howard has gotten exposed. Have you seen that? No. So, you remember the allegations he had like a while ago? With the uh, with the little tr- with the transgender or whatever that wrote a book oh about shit him. yeah so supposedly he is getting he's getting um he he has like a charge of like sexual assault on a on a man are you serious but the guy Dwight Howard admits to it but he said it was with consent oh yo shit. hold on bro let me see if I can Dwight find the article Howard bro game, it's bro. OD bro it's so bad let me let me see bro let me see if I can find the article bro. Cause that shit. Dwight Howard gay, bro. Like it says, Dwight Howard denies sexual assault charges by man he met via Instagram. Claims all activity was consensual. Bro, he said a man named Stephen Harper accused Dwight Howard of assault, battery, intentional infliction of emotional distress, and false imprisonment in 2021. False imprisonment. Yeah, bro. He said allegedly performed sexual acts that Harper did not consent to. The former NBA what star admitting communicating with the said person on Instagram before eventually meeting him. Harper provided text messages and an Uber receipt to prove he did hook up with Dwight Howard. Bro. Hold they, on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Said, Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Bro. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Is this like real sources? Like these are... Bro, this is a whole... Sources. It says sports kedia. Bro, supposedly the nigga... So this is what happened. It, it doesn't say it on here, but it said something about like... Dwight... So Dwight Howard hit him up on Instagram, right? They yeah. met in real life. They started kissing. They went back to the crib. Nigga, Dwight Howard sucked the nigga off. And then he forced that nigga to watch him have sex with a nigga dressed as a woman named Kitty. And that's what he's talking about imprisonment. <laughs> Wait, what in yeah. the fuck is actually Yo, going on? Bro, so that nigga Dwight Howard yes. sucked. That they go off, bro. Yes. Did his due diligence. Did his due diligence. And the oh, nigga was like, nigga. he wasn't fucking with it. He wasn't fuck. Wait, that's the what the guy said he wasn't fucking Yeah, the, the with guy it? said, he said, nah, I don't want to do this anymore. He don't want to do this. So Dwight, and then Dwight Howard forced him, forced to, him to watch him, him have, have sex, sex with a with trans. Ma- no, it was a man dressed as a woman. But it wasn't a trans. It was just a man dressed as a woman. Nigga name was Kitty. And it says it here. He said, in his complaint, Harper wrote that Superman also brought a man dressed as a woman who wanted to be called Kitty. He didn't want to join in the sexual activity that Kitty and Dwight Howard were doing, but was allegedly forced by the former NBA player. He says... Is def- this in Taiwan? It, I it- don't know where this is. <laughs> no, this was like two years ago. So this is like in America, bro. Bro, he said, defendant stood up, grabbed Mr. Harper by the thighs, forcibly removed Harper's underwear, held Mr. Harper down, and performed non-consensual oral sex on Mr. Harper. Mr. Harper that, was in I, fear I, of amendment bodily harm, I'm not but he was lie. pinned down... I, hold on, slow down, bro. I don't want slow down, bro. You, 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 you getting into detail, bro. Oh shit! Chill out, bro. Chill out. Slow down. All right. What can that guy do, honestly? I don't know. Cause Dwight Howard is six eleven. Six eleven, two fifty. I know. That's wow. I ain't gonna lie. Like what can like honestly, bro? I. <laughs> that's <laughs> not funny, but like, what can you do? What can you do? Nigga say he can't do nothing. I wouldn't be surprised if be that scared. happened. I'd be scared. Yeah, I'd be fucking terrified. A six eleven nigga, two two fifty holding me down and pause. Bro. Pause. <laughs> like I wouldn't be surprised if that shit really happened, bro. Like it, like That's... Dwight Howard, like he could, he could, he can do that. Too. Yeah, he could really fit. Like physically wise, he's really like, like he could really take your shit off. Pause. Like, take your pants off at his will, bro. That's so bad, That's bro. not okay, bro. Not like, okay. what is wrong with you, bro? Bro, and Dwight Howard said not everything was consent. So, it did yeah, happen. so it did happen. So, Dwight, bro. You know, when that when that video came out years ago, bro. Yeah. I'm like, ain't no fucking way. I know. And, and did, I'm pretty sure he denied it. He did deny it. He said, he's like, nah, that shit ain't me. And did the girl, I think the transgender, I think she, like, wrote a book or something like that oh, about, about the whole thing. Damn. And like he's like, nah, I ain't me. And now this shit came out. I'm like, oh. Yeah, now I'm looking at Honestly, bro. Oh my God. That's wild, bro. Cause like there'll be videos online of Dwight Howard touching niggas meat yeah, randomly. Exactly, right? Like you you see like videos online when Dwight Howard's like doing, you know Mookie stuff. Mookie shit, bro. And it's adding like, up. Then it's like it, 
of course that shit that shit's crazy like i don't know bro at this point but i mean it everything came to light now it was dwight gonna, howard is that's what i'm saying it was gonna come out eventually Dw- uh, hey dwight howard gave it is what it is it is or what it is bisexual yeah hey on the you know he's on the you know on the other side he on the other side there's no there's it no it problem with it, it. it is just, what it is you just gotta live up to it yeah you just gotta own it bro at this point but like, forcing a man to do that is crazy oh yeah yeah that oh yeah if what the nigga saying is true obviously it like you're a fucking monster my nigga. that is wild first of all like that's a nigga's worst fear bro yeah like <laughs> like just being like if a nigga seen that nigga dwight howard in prison bro like he imagine, could do whatever he want he could do what he want bro that, that nigga 611 i know i ain't gonna lie that's a prisoner's worst <laughs> nightmare that's bro. bad like and, and i wouldn't be surprised if the nigga was actually in prison to watch that shit, because what can you do? That is. Dwight Howard is fast as fuck. I know you can't. You can't outrun a nigga. You you can't. You can't hide from the nigga. He gonna yeah, find you. You can't. You can't out straight them. Like you can't do nothing, bro. That nigga's. Be, the oh, nigga's no, I'm, just, I'm beating his ass. I'm be. I'm gonna find a way to beat his ass. Nah, but yeah, but what were, where were they at? They was. I think they was at his house. But like oh, he like room? he like. I guess the nigga didn't want to do it. He like forcefully was like nah. That's some okay. crazy shit. There's a okay, <laughs> and another another question. Arises. To Dwight Howard, <laughs> where would you find the nigga that w- that was? Just, first of all, why is she dressed like a woman? Also, <laughs> that's what yeah. I want to know. I know, like, why you gotta do this to this guy? And this guy's over here perfectly fine. He's yeah, willing. yeah, yeah. Like, why? And the, the nigga wants to be called Kitty. Like, where do you find niggas like that? Like, hey, bro, in the, the deep darks of the <laughs> internet. Like, that is crazy. Hey, man, it's a wild Don't world we live fuck, in, bro. bro. And to piggyback off that, bro, have you seen the list on Twitter that's been going around of like the places, the list of places women won't, the list of places women don't want to go to on a first date? No, I didn't. Well, we're gonna react to it and we're gonna see how bad it is from a scale of one to All ten, right, bro. Let's, let's see, bro. This shit is the most outlandish shit I've ever seen in my life. If mother, don't take me, don't piss me off, bro. So, so basically, like I said, people, it's top. It's a list of places that women collectively maybe like a, i don't know how big the group is said that they would not go to if a guy asked them on a first date to so the first one is cheesecake factory the fuck yes that's not that bad cheesecake factory is not that bad that, that like like okay that is that, class that listen cheesecake factory like i'll go there yeah but it's not a place where you go to often i ain't gonna lie like I don't really like it too much. It's not. Day. It's it's overrated. It's overrated because one, there's too much shit on the menu, mm. and it's like I'm only gonna get one. It's like I'd rather get the appetizers than the entrees. Exactly. Not even that, that's exactly what it is. But like that's like a high end. Like that's above like, like, Outback. That's above Outback. You think so? You think that's above Outback? Like just like the ambiance, what they sell. Yeah, the ambiance. I think it's all like the aesthetics, like the place, like the place looks like it's like a high end place, like when you go inside Cheesecake Factory. But the food don't match the place, the aesthetic. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Because I feel like it's just a bigger thing. But would you take a girl there first date? First date? Yeah. I'll take a girl there too. Cheesecake? Cheesecake Factory? Hell yeah. yeah. I'll take, that's what I'm saying. I'll I'll take it there. I'll take it there. All right. First of all, that's. That's good. That's a, like, that's. That's, that's a pretty ex- big. Like, I know, that's, that's a lot. That's, that's what I'm saying. Pretty, it gets like, worse, bro. Right. Applebee's. That they wouldn't go to Applebee's. Yeah. I under, I'm, I, I'm the, understanding a little bit. The, the, with me, hey, I'm not a big Applebee's fan either. Okay, okay. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't take. You want to take them to Applebee's? Nah, unless okay. they like going to Applebee's. Okay, okay. What if, like, what they say that Apple, if, if they say Applebee's like their favorite, their favorite place all the time, I'll take it to Applebee's first time. I'll take it to Applebee's first time if that's a favorite place of all time, but then I'm going to question why is that your favorite place of all time because that shit's <laughs> trash. <laughs> Maybe they just haven't opened their horizons. Yeah, Applebee's mid. But, okay, so are you okay with that being on the list? Like a place that they wouldn't want to go to. Are you okay with Applebee's? Yes like and Applebee's. no. Yes and no. Cause like 
Applebee's sometimes do be hidden though. That's what I'm saying. Like I would say Applebee's as a date to go to, like if we're like a couple dates in or like yeah, yeah, a couple yeah. years and, in. And now need like you just want to like go to like a quick spot, like a cool spot, yeah. and, like get some eats, you know, and you know that's the only place. Yeah, that's, it's like a, it's like an additional date. Yeah, just in, like it's just it's just something that you know you just go on the to. side. Like, yeah, on the side, bro. Okay, okay. Just, like you don't want to spend too much. Exactly. You know. You, you know yeah. I, I would, get it. Yeah. But, I mean, motherfucker, if I take you that shit, you, you shouldn't be fucking... Mad. Mad. That's what I'm saying. I know Fridays is on there. It's actually not on there. What the fuck? How is Applebee's... Chili's is next. Chili's hit. Chili's is rocking. They're bugging. You know what it is, though? I, it's probably, like, the place itself. Like Why, that, though? Like, Chili's is good. Like, it's not no, even that Chili's nasty looking. No, Chili's is good. But I don't know. Maybe it's the... Maybe it's the sound of yeah. He took me to Chili's on the first date. Does that sound Dude, weird? I mean, I I mean, I'm it's no, probably what it is, bro. I mean, like, where'd you take your girl on the first date? Nigga, we went out to do some fun shit. Like what? Nah, it was like <laughs> we went to Dave and Buster's. <laughs> okay, me, that's mid. That's not that bad. That's trash, bro. That's not that trash. David Buster's for the first date, that's yeah, not bad. That's, that's not bad. Me and Jay went to the movies. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga laughing at me. <laughs> hey, look, look. To, okay. <laughs> to my, to my okay. De- hold on, hold on. I'm de- not laughing that you guys went to the movies. <laughs> it's how you said it. <laughs> Nigga, you felt, you seemed like you was ashamed of it. Cause Cause it was like, me and went to the movies. Because <laughs> it, like, it was like, so first of all, I wanted to take it to Bonchon. Because she always talked about she loved Bonchon. But she wanted to make it a double date. She wait, wanted, wait, wait, wait. No, oh, yeah. She wanted to make it a two man. I'm like, hell no. I'm like, what the fuck? She was like, bring Corey for, for my friend. I'm like, what the fuck? I was like, hell no. I was like, I ain't going to. I was like, hell. And then, and then she, I was like, you know what? And then I hit her with like some smooth shit. I was like, what did I say? I was like, I hit her like last minute. I was like, yo, you trying to go to movies tonight? Like, you're not doing nothing. And she yeah. was like, she was like, all right. She was mad nervous though. So I was like, but I was like, dang, the movies. Like, I didn't want to break. Like, the first option wasn't the movies. Why is she looking at me like that? <laughs> the first no, option Jay wasn't did, the movie. Jay didn't fuck with you. <laughs> she was like, yo, I gotta go to the movies with this Nah, nigga. you know what's crazy? You know where we went, bro? Went to Jersey Gardens, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Jersey Gardens? Fritz, that's I didn't know. Bad, I didn't, that's yo, bad. I movies. Didn't, Fritz, that's I didn't bad know. spot, bro. Fritz, I didn't, I, all I knew was Jersey Gardens and, and Union Theaters. Yeah. Like, I didn't know. <laughs> bro, I didn't know there was reclining chairs in, in yeah. movie theaters. Anymore. Yo, I'm I, 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 I know it. I'm doing it. Bro. <laughs> like, come on. Oh, bro, I, honestly, bro. I did until, not know that. Until I, sh- I found out there's a plethora, a plethora. Of, of nice movie theaters. <laughs> Nigga, I've been going to Jersey Gardens, the slums. <laughs> I've been going life, to the ghetto bro. my whole life. That I, shit ass, bro. Bro, yo, we... Nah, I'm already I, doing it, bro. I knew, I knew she liked me because, you know... <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I keep talking. Because we was... So, so I was like... I did, We was watching... um, uh, What's that shit called? Uh, escape room, the first one, mm-hmm. the first escape room movie. Mm-hmm. I was mad smooth, so I, I put the yeah, I put the yeah, RC yeah, up, yeah. and I was like, "What I say?" I was like, "I just grabbed it." So he's cuddling, <laughs> right? The whole time, I didn't know she was uncomfortable. Yeah. So she oh, sat she through that whole thing, back hurting. Legs, <laughs> oh legs, yeah, you did tell me that. You did tell me that. <laughs> legs, legs fell asleep, uncomfortable. So I was like, "Oh nah, that's crazy." I <laughs> Wait, so I first I asked this already. What? You knew a different. You knew other movie theaters, right? Oh yeah, I oh, didn't. Yeah, t- I just oh, said yeah, the movie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jersey Bro, Gardens is that pretty, is yeah, bad. It's bad. So I, that was a first. That was date. the first date. Jersey Gardens, movie theater. For Jersey Gardens was the first date. Everyone who's from Jersey and shit like that. At least where we're from, you know. Where Jersey we're from, Gardens. you know Jersey Gardens. The that worst mall. That shit's ass. <laughs> there's a fight every two days. The worst mall, like there's no good. Food places. Food places and like the spot is like just, just the mall it's is just horrible. It's just horrible. Yeah, that's but, that's us. But yeah, so yeah. so that and then the next one that they talk about, they say your house. Yeah, that's a bad date. That's yeah, a that's bad first. That's a bad. Date. That's a, that's, that's a bad first. That, date. That's a bad. That, date. That's that's that should okay. be number one. Wait, these are ranked. No, like, they're not ranked. This is just a list. Okay, of yeah, yeah. Your house definitely. If you if Fellas, you're, bro, if you're trying to pursue a relationship with a girl, bro, don't take it to your crib the first. Even date, if you got like, a nice ass crib. 
What if, okay, what if it's like a mansion type shit? Is she it's like a from, mansion? Is she from you, the ghetto? You, if, if it, oh, of course. <laughs> uh, if she, what the fuck? If it's a mansion and she from the ghetto, nigga, everything's good. What the <laughs> fuck? Like, like your house is gonna look like the fucking movie theater. And yes. Everything, oh my buddy. god. Yep. Yeah. Unless bro. you're rich. Unless you're rich. Unless you're rich, bro. And you got the mansion and you got a movie theater in your crib and you got like a you got this, some cool this, shit. That and the th- take it to your crib, bro. Now you 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 get to show her. The life that she gets to live, if you, you know what I'm ah, saying? Yeah, you yeah. gotta see that. You, know, you gotta uh, show a preview. You gotta show a preview. There's, there's, a, there's, a, there's a sneak peek. But don't overwhelm no, her. Though. Don't overwhelm, don't overwhelm her. her. That's yeah, not because good. Because then she's gonna be, be like, oh, I'm definitely gone. You know, oh, what I'm, I'm definitely broke as fuck. Yeah, and then she's yeah, gonna feel yeah, bad yeah, about yeah, this. Yeah, but uh, definitely your house. Don't take it to your yeah, house. Yeah, if, you, bro. if, you if live, you're trying to be in a relationship. Yeah, nah, not the house. If it's just, you know, one, two, go crazy, bro. All right. The next. Well, there's a whole lot, but I'm just skipping through. One of them that sticks out, it says a buffet. Yeah, buffets are trash. Buffets are trash. What if it's a good buffet? I don't know one good buffet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be honest with you. Buffet's not that bad. Oh, my God. I don't think Darius. that's that bad. Nah, buffets are trash, man. <laughs> I ain't going to love bad. Bro. This is this is This is how I think of it. You need a place where you guys could just sit down and yeah. speak to each other and just, like, like, Get like sh- food has to be served to you, bro. What if I go and grab? But like, look, think about it like this. I right? don't like like I went to Golden Corral. That shit's ass. Okay, Golden Corral is pretty bad. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I, I, like when we was kids, I don't know what happened. That shit that was the shit, greatest thing in the world. Amazing. I used to be excited. Yeah. Golden Corral. <laughs> yo, I used my, to be my girl said the same thing. I was, she was like, like, yo, that shit used to like be. Like, I don't amazing. know what happened. I think they changed like shit, cooks. Yo, that shit ass, bro. bro I used to, I don't know, but I don't know one good buffet. I'm gonna be honest with you. Like you can't name one good buffet. I had the, I'm, I don't the, even want to hear it. The Flaming Grill in Linden. You just lost me, bro. <laughs> I know that shit ass. You never been there before? No. You didn't wait. Did you? You didn't go with us with Quaku and Quaku threw up. I think he was there. Oh, I did go there. It was me, you, Mike Charles, Quaku. Yeah. Oh shit. Yeah. That shit was ass. That shit was ass. <laughs> the fuck. <laughs> was was Charles was uh, Charles with us? Well, I think it. It was yeah. What's Charles? With I don't know. It was one that more was person. That's when we fought Fat Boy S- SSC. Yeah, that's when Fat Boy SSC and Will Vicky was. was, yeah, was, was yeah, 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 yeah. I forgot. There was one more person, but I don't know if it was Charles. Yeah, that shit was ass. That shit was ass. Yeah, yeah. Oh my was god! All right, flaming bro. Grill, flaming Grill, was ass. All right, Buffet, bro. Buffets in general, until I find a good ass buffet where the. Eats are like not dry as fuck because they always be dry. See, but bro. I think I know why. It's because like they're there's they have to produce so much food that they can't put like too much time into it. That's true. To make it good, so they and, just it's just more about quantity than quality. And I, I really, and I um really um wish, not wish, but I. What the fuck? I'm getting blank. I re- like I accept that. Like I I really um I'm getting a blank, bro. I <laughs> can move on, bro. Okay, what the okay. Fuck? All right. So. I understand that. Okay, there we go. Oh, you there understand it? Like, I had a blank. So, <laughs> I, yeah, they had to, they have to produce, like, mad food. Yeah. And, and, like, I understand that. But, motherfucker, still, like, that shit's, like, if niggas, I, I agree with that. Don't don't take a girl to the buffet. Okay, okay. I don't think so. I don't think it's good quality food. I feel like, bro, I feel like, this is what I feel like, bro. You have to, like, especially if you're trying to pursue a relationship with the girl. This is an impressor, bro. Don't take it to, to a spot where bad eats. Yeah, you can't. Not like, like, but it, it's, Applebee's is not. It's not bad. It's not bad. But, um, it's, but you also got a real. You got. It's you have to know the person. That's why you got to do your homework. You before. do have to know the person because if you just. Ask them on the first day, like, yo, let's go on a date. And you take them to some shit like, oh, maybe they're allergic to, like, shellfish. Yeah. And you go to Red Lobster. Yeah, you, now you're yeah. fucked up. Yeah, yeah. Now you're fucked yeah, up. Yeah, you got to yeah, do your homework. That's yeah, why you can't you rush gotta into the first day. That's very it true. Got, the first day got to happen. Gotta, How long do you think it should take for the first date to happen? Mm, that's a good question. Probably. I would say, like, a two, week. Two, week or two, two? A week or two of talking. A week or two of talking? Yeah, a week you, really gotta, you really got to, like. You know, you got like you gotta you gotta know you gotta, you gotta hype gotta, up. You gotta get excited for the day. Exactly, and you gotta know what what the ends and like you gotta know what she likes, what she doesn't. You know what I'm saying? Like, but like, what's too late for for a date? Like, what 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 do you think is too late? Because I feel like for me, maybe like five to seven days. You should be that should be the range where like no less than five, no more than like seven eight. I feel like once you go past like. 
maybe the the, t- the ten days because that's when they start being like, yo, when he's gonna take me on a date? Like you talking all this shit, like you ain't gonna take me on a date. Oh, yeah, that is, you know that what I'm saying? True. Like they start, they start like waiting, and they start losing interest. Like yeah, this nigga not serious, and then he's like, ah, oh, you're fucked up. Damn, that's true. You know what um, I'm saying? Uh, uh, I think, I think yeah, I say. Seven like eight days. Eight days. Eight days max. max. Eight to ten. Eight, eight to, to ten, ten max. Eight, eight to, to ten, ten max. max. Depending how how busy you are. Yeah. In the circumstance, eight to ten max. Yeah, yeah. And I, it's also depends on the girl too. Exactly. Like if exactly. She, if she's re- ready to go on the ready date. Ready to go. On you know what I'm saying? Exactly. All right. The next one is church. Yeah. Yeah, bro. Is church a bad first date? I, d- depending God, on the person. Depend- why did you could have chose something else? <laughs> I want. I don't want to see. <laughs> church not bad. Let's okay, go praise okay, God li- together. Listen, yo. listen, listen, listen. That's key right there. Listen, now that right there for the right really person. depends on the girl. Yeah, for the right person, oh, like, you might be like, through the door, bro. Like, yeah, like, okay, so if obviously if the girl's religious and, you know, you know, really into that, um, it's either, it could go either two ways. Mm-hmm. She really appreciates stuff like that and like, oh, yeah, he's a real... Gentleman, he's a gentleman and, like and he's that, a church yeah. go, or oh man, this guy's weird. This like this guy is weird. He a loser. Like, he's a, yeah, they, like it could go either way. It could go either way. It, you know what are you looking at? <laughs> it could go either way, and I don't think I don't think I don't necessarily think like oh if you like the first date. Oh, the niggas. She they shouldn't think that he's a loser. They should think oh he's a real like gentleman. He's a real gentleman. He's, a real he's, a real he's religious, real. but like some people. Get some girls are that. gonna get thrown off about that. They're yeah. gonna really get thrown off. Yeah, about I know, that. I know. Like, I don't even think that they're gonna consider that as a date. Yeah, I don't honestly. think so. I think they're, they're just gonna hanging gonna, out. They're, yeah, they're just gonna be like, oh yeah, we're just hanging out and okay. we went to church. Okay. I don't think they, I don't think that's gonna be considered a date. Okay, okay. The but ne- yeah, the next one is ice cream dates. Yeah, I was never. I've never now, seen that, bro. Now I never. I never seen the big deal of ice cream dates. You, like you have to do it like like tactical though. You got think ice cream can't be the main date. It got to be like the, the additional slash. Yeah, like, so it got to be extra. after something. Yeah, like after you go to the carnival something. or after you go to like the beach. Okay. After you go out to dinner, you go to like Dairy Queen or some shit for some yeah, ice cream. You can't make ice cream the main That can't shit. be the main thing. First date. of all, you're not filling her up on no- nothing. Like like she's still <laughs> gonna be hungry. She's surely still gonna be starving. <laughs> She ain't gonna she like, gonna she, a, like, like come a on, vanilla cone. She vanilla cone. Like <laughs> she's still gonna be hungry as hell. Like I feel like I feel like yeah. Like after you, I, I got some eats and so, some mm-hmm. shit. Like you, you take it to ice cream, get some ice cream. But like, imagine niggas talk about like we're gonna go out to get some. I never have I done that. But, I have. I'm bugging. What like a like an ice cream? Yeah, thing? like like can we like let's go get some ice cream? Yeah. Like I've done that, but but that's like like say like it's like, it wasn't our first date. Though. Yeah, it's like, not the first. I okay, so, but like it's say like you know when you go to remember the the fireworks in Union. Yeah. See, that's the first day. Like, Yo, let's go to the fireworks first date. Yeah. And then boom, and then take it to Rita's. I, yeah. Yeah. Not Rita's. Not Rita's, but nah, it but gotta be something Queen? cool. Maybe Cold Stone. Cold. Damn, you're so bougie. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> what the fuck? Cold Stone. Yo, Cold Stone is rocking. It is rocking. That shit, Brett. <laughs> <laughs> God damn, Fritz. <laughs> Yeah, Coastal is bread. Yeah, I don't know, bro. Like, I feel like readers is played out, bro. You gotta do something different. No, I, I understand. Like, I love Coastal, <laughs> but like, that's just like a once a summer type of thing. You can't just keep going to co- that shit like twelve dollars a cup, cause what the <laughs> fuck? That should be so much bread, bro. Like, oh my, like yo, don't. I really love Coastal, bro. Like, I, like me and Jay went to Coastal one summer. When we found out that like maybe three, four times. I haven't been back since. <laughs> that shit's too much money. <laughs> like that shit's really wild, bro. Nah, that shit is bread. That oh shit is bread. Oh my god, but, bro. Um, okay, <laughs> okay. Depending on God, readers, bro. Like it's all right, but like just whatever, like ice or like a like whatever a, you go for, bro. Whatever you go for, <laughs> you go, you go, bro. <laughs> not, not trying to be, not trying to be rude. Whatever niggas go for, bro. Oh, like a, readers is good. Yeah, or like readers is rocking. Or like man. a you know like a family owned ice cream shop is cool. Yeah, that shit's kind of cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you all don't right. gotta go what, to coast. Though. There's another one. It says so. The next one is somewhere that requires a long drive. So. I can understand this one because now you're in the car with that person. And you guys get 
you have to make you have to make conversation. You know, sometimes it could be type awkward. Yeah, they don't know the music. I could understand that, but like yeah. if you've been talking to them for the, the past like couple of days and like you guys have clicked and you guys is like together and like you, we want to go to like Six Flags, because Six Flags what like fifty minutes away from us. Yeah, like that's not too bad. <laughs> Like I feel like if me and Jay was in the car, like I like I would be nervous too because I would be like, dang, like this is the first time like we hanging out. Mm. Like, what am I gonna say? All and this. And not only that, bro. Like instead of like, it could it could go other way. Like the music could just be blasting. Y'all niggas just listening to music and shit like that, and not even saying a word that's to each saying. other. That's, that that's ass. That's why you know this is the this is the key, bro, fellas. If let you me watch, know. Let if me you know. Listen bro. this right now. Put niggas on, bro. You gotta make. It might be a little simple. Make a little playlist. You know what I'm saying? Make a little playlist of music. If you go into like, say you go into like pick her up or some shit, don't don't put no freaky shit in there. <laughs> like when she opened a car door, she listened to fucking Keith, like motherfucking Keith Trey, Trey songs and shit like that. <laughs> don't do that. Put like put like the the R and B shit. Yeah. And like put like the R and B music. So like have a mix of R and B. Like what's popular now, like yep. some hype music, yep. like in a mix. So like, it should be like, damn, this is my shit. Yeah, yeah. And then yeah, now yeah, you yeah. figure out now you sing along together. Yo, nigga, no, I was nigga. He put niggas on. He put on. I, I caught it with that one though. Yeah. Oh, where? I caught it with that one. What, what, what was the song? It was a uh, Chris Brown. Uh, <laughs> it was freaking. It was like yo. It was like yo. Oh yo. yo. Excuse me, miss. I saw like him from, from across, across the room. room. Nigga, yeah. I, I was like, yo, yo, a conference. I yeah. was in the car. I was like, I was like, damn, some of these songs not hitting. And I was like, this one gotta hit. And then she's like, this is my shit. I said, yeah. <laughs> Where was y'all going? Y'all was going to like a long ass. Like, that's no, that's when we was going to the movie. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, I, had to, I had to hype it up, bro. I don't know what she she didn't know what she was getting into, bro. I had to, <laughs> I think it was after the movie. Yo, bro, that is hilarious. Yo, bro, that yeah, shit. I mean, wait. So they said they they wouldn't want something. They wouldn't that want something that requires a long drive, which I understand because that is kind of nervous. Yeah, it can be. Because especially for girls, they'd be a little nervous on the first date. Like, yeah. yeah, this, that, and the third. Like he, like, what if he's a weirdo? We mm-hmm. even don't like the same type of music. I understand that, but like, yeah, if it's something that. fun though. Yeah, like, that's, that's that's fine. Like, yeah. like you got something to look forward to, type mm-hmm. shit. And then afterwards, now you get to talk about yo. Like, if we went late, like, yo, you was ass as fuck, lazy tag, this, that, they're like, yo, like, we should do it again. And then you got more stuff to talk about. Yeah, so yeah. I don't think that's too bad. <coughs> the next one is uh, nightclubs. Now, I don't think that it might be one of the worst dates to go to. Yeah, why? That might be terrible. Be like, yo, c- come, to, come to the club with me. That's yeah, ass. Yeah, that's, I'm, if a nigga does that shit, like, what are you doing? That's weird as fuck. Are you setting yourself up for, for like failure. For failure, bro. Like, why you want to go to, like, a club? Like, bro, at the end of the day, bro, the dates, dates, bro, has to be. Personal preference personal. of the woman. Yeah, and not only that, it has to be. It's about you two, bro. It is about Two yeah. people, bro. Yeah. You don't want to be around motherfuckers just, like, dancing and, and shit. Drinking. That's cool. And drinking and shit like that. That's just, it got to be, like, you, both you guys, bro, just, like, having a good time, bro. Imagine, bro. Imagine. That'd be crazy, bro. A nigga take your girl? A nigga take that's what your I'm girl out right in front of you, go. That's what I was about to ask that's you. That's crazy would, work. Would you think that's, like, a red flag if a girl be like, yeah, I'm cool going yeah. to the club? I would think that's kind of crazy. Yeah. Bro. Like, Honestly, uh, bro, not, not, like, I'm going to be like, yo, like, what? Like, yeah, why, like, like, why are you so excited, bro? Like, exactly. chill out. <laughs> like, like I, I wouldn't bro. like that, nah. Like, like damn, like especially if the motherfucker already goes to the club often. Like yeah. damn, you 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 not trying to just like chill, chill like, like, like have conversations. Yeah, talk to me yeah, you like to this music. Yeah, and, you can't even like have a conversation. You really can't have a conversation at the club. You can. How the fuck like, you have a conversation, yo? <laughs> now you really not going like the music is blasting. Like that's a terrible they, conversation. Like, shorty's shorty probably drinking. Y'all both drinking and shit like, like that. And nigga, like that's, you can't have a conversation. Like you. I feel like <clears throat> the first date, like, really has to, you you got to have time to have a conversation with, like, like get to know each other. Even though y'all, y'all, like, already knowing each other through text, y'all need to, it's different when it's, like, face-to-face. Because now it's, like, the reaction. In text, you can think about what you, you got to say. About, exactly. You can think about mm-hmm. what you got to say, but, exactly. like, you know, it's different face-to-face. You got to, commu- like, communicate. So, like. 
Yeah, the the club is definitely it's, that's, that's number bad. one. That's like, bad. Don't, don't take don't take sure. Don't take the club. Don't take it to the club. I don't care if it's the best club in the world. Don't take it to the club. Don't take it to the club. Nah, don't bro. do that. Like, don't do on, that, son. bro. That's and bad. Now niggas steal your bitch or badger, bro. You go to the crazy, bathroom. Then she gone. Shorty dancing with. Sh- uh, imagine that, that. I hope. I hope that's never happened in somebody, bro. I hope that's 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 gonna change a nigga forever, bro. <laughs> like the first. But he set di- himself up for failure. You did set yourself up for failure, like, but like. Hey, Damn, like that's so ass. But it'd be crazy if short if the girl, yeah, if the girl asked me, what if the girl asked me to like, Dance yeah, you try and go to the club, like, oh you, yeah, it, nah, like you want to go to the club for the first day, like, imagine, bro. Nah, I would be. I look at it kind of weird because yeah, especially back then, like me, I was like, I didn't really like going yeah, outside. Exactly. So I'm like, yeah, no, nah, I'm cool off that. That ain't, that ain't me. Like, I like, nah, hell no. And then wait, okay, r- quick question. What? Like, the the nigga has to. Initiate the first date? Initiate the first date. Yeah. But what if, like, the girl, like, initiates the first date? Like, you wouldn't... I wouldn't mind. You wouldn't mind? I wouldn't like, mind. Like, what, what would be... <laughs> not trying to be... Not trying... Now we're switching, like... We're switching, oh, we're switching roles? We're switching roles. Like, what would be the first date that'd be like, damn, like, I fuck with this girl. Like, you know oh, what I'm okay. saying? You know what I'm saying? Like, so what, what would get you? <laughs> it won't get me? Yeah, well, if the girl, if the girl trying to bag you... <laughs> Like shorty try to bag you. What, right. what would get if it's you? a date, would be like, say it's like a place where we can. It's like something fun. Yeah, something fun. Something fun and like an activity to do. Mm-hmm. Like if it's like a ah, damn, I feel I sound like a <laughs> bougie motherfucker. <laughs> like if it was like a say we went to like a she's like yo let's go to um like something fun like something like a like a top golf or like a damn fucking, <laughs> that's bread and you talk about cold stone. <laughs> Yo, like, top golf. Sometimes I don't even eat at top because <laughs> I'm already spending my bread. Okay, if yo, it, that's bread. But it's like a like like some something fun though, like something where it's like an activity, like yeah, yeah, yeah. like go kart bowling. I think top golf is a really good, like a a, a real nice like good place. Like, that's what I'm saying to, to go. You know, especially like if y'all. Like both been there, sport. like for yeah, sport sport oriented, like mm-hmm. y- and like y'all want to try something new. Like y'all yeah. both never tried none, like golfing or some shit. Like yeah. top golf is a pretty good. That's what I'm saying. Like, first. like so, sh- shit like that, like something, something where it's like something I've never been to before, but it's like something like fun activity wise. Mm-hmm. Like like so either, you just want to have some yeah something fun. fun. Like there's a there's a thing in um the mall. It's called I forgot what it's called. That me and Jay went to. It's like a place where it's like you open each door. And it's like a it's like a challenge or whatever. It's like a fun game or whatever. It's like a like like you movement and shit yeah, like yeah. that. If we went to some shit like that our first date, I'd be like, and she's like going stupid, going crazy. It's oh, not yeah, like I'm yeah, care. Like, oh yeah, like she hold it. Oh, I'm like oh, hold yeah. on. That's all. That's, that's, that's all. That's that's all. That's <laughs> like it's like like. All right, so so what if what if um she brought you to that spot that we went to in New York? What's that spot? What that the? ninja spot would would that be? Oh yeah, that would be fun. That'd be as fun hell. for you. Hell like, yeah! You, you I'm do, like you. I'm like but, you but like you, this shit. But but like it's not a spot where you guys could just like. I mean, it is. You yeah. guys can just talk. Like we just talked about. Like yeah. Like you gotta have a conversation. You know, get to know. Her, like. I understand. So like with that, I feel like. It's a. It would be a good date because one is pretty far. So that's why I'm saying the, the car ride is oh, gonna be cool. Car we can talk ride. in I the didn't, car I didn't ride. I think of that one. I didn't think yeah, of you, you got it. You got it. You, you got talk it. in the car ride. That's you right. have this fun ass shit, and now you talk about it afterwards. Like, yo, like I don't know. You was good at this shit. You do all this yeah. shit. Like, what you do? Like, why you do yeah, something? Yeah. I did you. Nigga. Yeah, yeah, you're right. You're right. She you teach it. me how to do a backflip. Yeah. Yo, come on, that'd be fire. Yeah, that, that'd that's be tough. That's tough. How about you? I know you bougie. I'm a little stop. Stop saying that. Stop saying that. Watch don't, his. Watch his answer. Don't, now. don't bring bouginess into into my go, realm, bro. Go ahead. Go ahead. What you say? Right, for me, bro, it like you know I have I have different you know choices. You know, like I do like the fun shit. Yeah. But I don't want to do all that. I don't want to be. Like if she took me to that ninja spot, nah, but I don't want to be sweaty, bro. Really? I don't want to be sweaty, nah, bro. Like I don't want to be sweaty. Okay. Take me out to a good spot, <laughs> <laughs> to like a good spot. Honestly, bro, I'm not gonna lie. Movies is not a bad. It's not a bad date. It is no. It depends what movie. Now I need that. And it has just like the ice cream. It has to be after. Okay, so it has to be after. It like has a to dinner. be after. Yep. Has has a movie date is an additional date. Yeah, it's like an additional date. Got you. A got movie you. date is always the additional date. Don't you like either take her, t- take her to the movies before or after. Okay. So, for me, 
I would either want to go to the movies either before or after to a nice movie theater. You know what I'm saying? Like a good, a nice movie theater like where Cinemark. my seat could, yeah, my seat could recline or I could get some eats, you know, <laughs> you know, shit. food coming towards me. And yeah, good movie, good movie. Then the eats, out. You know what I'm saying? I don't know, but nah, I've been. Wait, what do you think? Yo, wait, wait, yo. Something's going to impress the fuck out of you. Something that's going to impress the fuck out of like, me. But you like, yo, damn, like, she really like me for real. Listen, I'm not going to say the crazy ass shit. If she took me to, I ain't going to lie, if she took me to BJ's, you, you after lit? the movie theater, I fuck with it. Ah, I, fuck, I fuck with it, dude. Okay. That, that's, 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 that's good ease right Is there. Is she driving or are you driving? Oh, she driving too? I'm passenger the princess for the day. <laughs> nah, you can't be passenger princess first day, cuz. Oh, man. Nah, I gotta drive. You gotta drive. I gotta drive. I gotta drive. Yeah, because, nah, passenger the princess. You paying the first bill? You paying the, the bill? You paying? I'm paying for the, I pay for the first day. I'm paying for the whole day. I be paying nah, for the whole day. Nah, I, I, yeah, I paid for the first day. Yeah, like, I paid for, I'll pay for the first day. But that's cool. Yeah, but if she, if she has a plan, that's her plan to do all that shit, you know And then saying? she's just like, you drive and all that. Yeah, I'll, I'll do that. That'll be fun, I, though. I, 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 I fuck with it. But I don't like doing too much, like with the with the dates. Like I don't like doing too much, like. Like I, I just I just I like seeing if like you can keep hold your own, like, like either like physically or like with some random, like with like games or whatever. Yeah, yeah. that's just like another. Cause I remember I told you like when me when me and Jay I forgot when we was um we hung out one time, and I was like we we hung out at her parents' gym and that's when they had a basketball hoop. I was like all right, let's play one on one. I let her get ball first. I didn't know she would play basketball. She shot that shit like Curry and made it. I was made like, that shit, yeah. I'm in love, bro. <laughs> Nigga, I was like, oh, hold on. This is a new, this is new. This, that shit had form to it. That shit followed through, cuz. I was like, that shit wasn't one of these, motherfucker. <laughs> that shit went in. That nigga like, said, oh, that yeah. That shit was the flick of the ring. I was like, nah. That was like, that's, that's a, that's that's a point right you. there, bro. That's what got you. You got two points. That's you don't hard. even know about it, bro. That's, that's hard, bro. That's hard. <laughs> Type shit, bro. <laughs> But that is hilarious. Hey bro. man. But these these lists the, the, the more shit on here is kind there's a lot more shit that's outlandish as fuck. There's one that says sporting that sports events. What sports events is tough? That's what I'm saying. Nah, if I if I if I pay for floor seats to a Lakers game, it, that shit's the best exact, date in the world. It, it's 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 cuz it's cuz it's probably bitches that don't even I guess don't like sports, but motherfucker they they uh, nigga a nigga took you Courtside to a Knicks game. To a Knicks game, motherfucker. You gonna enjoy you that. You gonna shit. enjoy that shit because you lie. right there. Don't lie. You just you just you just don't want to be up there and not be able to come on, son. Stop, stop being disrespectful to niggas, bro. <laughs> stop being disrespectful to niggas, stop bro. Stop being disrespectful don't to niggas. Don't disrespect bro. niggas, bro. Hey. But oh, but what if what if she, is a concert a bad date? No, I don't think a concert. concert that's a great date. Like if like that's a great date. If especially if it's a person she like and she know that like, you will go out and be like, yeah. but that's also you know, that could be like an addition, like a side date, like yeah, a surprise. Yeah, yeah, be like, yeah. oh, we go, go yeah, we go God, to dinner first to, to see this. And then thing. we go to tickets to see Beyonce, whatever. Oh, Beyonce's crazy. <laughs> that is bread. <laughs> <laughs> For first date is crazy. Where are you going to go? Nah, you got to go somewhere else. I don't know, bro. Like what? She better like Rod Wave or something. Cause Rod Wave's still bread. That's bread, but not as Beyonce <laughs> bread. <laughs> Beyonce is like a thousand a pop. <laughs> like, Why? It's so much money. It is it's it's so, so much, much money. money. Nah, but Beyonce O D, she be she she, she, she be wilding with the prices, cut. Huh? Her and Taylor Swift. Like bro. her and Taylor Swift. I feel like right wave pre- reasonable. Right wave cool. Nah, that'd yeah. be great. It's it's good. That'd be great. That'd be cool. Yeah, yes, it, it's so, that'd be cool. Hey so, fellas, take notes, bro. That was a we got that was a whole forty minutes of game, uh, bro. Uh, yeah, bro. Like nigga, honestly, bro. Niggas do not, oh, yo, even some, I mean, there's some girls, but even picnics could be a first Oh, a picnic date, is a good, is a it's great, a great date. date. With like, some good scenery, some good food, some good eats. Come on, son. With some games. Come on, son. That's great. Come on, son. That's a good first date. You guys, like, it's it's just a chance for you to get to know each other, bro. How many like, picnics have you been on? Like, have, nev- you took, none. You never been, you never took a good no. picnic? Why? <laughs> because. Because <laughs> it's a lot of work. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga's active. He's trying to, he's trying to make y'all do it, but okay, he don't want to fucking work. Fuck! Listen, 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 listen to me. <laughs> like what the? I'm fuck? just kidding. I'm suggesting y'all niggas. I know, I mean, I'm doing it. <laughs> Wait, 
right, all right, all right. I've done everything else. No, no. <laughs> Why is a picnic so much work? Listen, bro. I gotta buy the shit. I gotta <laughs> listen. I gotta. I gotta set the shit up. <laughs> I gotta get the games. <laughs> Hello this, work. This, this, I gotta find out where to go. Like, <laughs> like that's so much work, bro. and it gotta be a surprise and shit. Like, I, I just, how oh, I'd rather not. <laughs> maybe, one crazy, <laughs> maybe one no, day. Maybe one day. Maybe one day, bro. You really just need a blanket. Some you could just get fast food. Listen, I'd rather like. Get something that I could just like, <laughs> like I could pay for, like, like you can pay for you pay for all this shit. Yeah, but then I gotta set shit up and shit. What like was you that. doing during quarantine? Huh? <laughs> What'd you do during quarantine? Oh, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I worked. I think it was working and just stay at and, home dates and, stay there and, and chill. And I was damn near sick half quarantine, bro. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. COVID swore my ass during quarantine. <laughs> Oh Kobe, my god. Kobe bro. had me in the chokehold, But uh oh nah, my I ain't, god, do, I ain't bro. do that much during quarantine, bro. Nigga, me lie. and Jay went on like I think we went on like two picnics. For real? Yeah. It's crazy. Quarantine was really like what? Almost about to be four years ago. It don't feel like it for real. What the fuck? Yeah, that's it crazy. It don't feel like it at all. Like that's crazy. Like it feels like it was like last year. And bro, I seen something the other I seen something on TikTok, bro. Like it was kind of weird. So like you know how I was it was about SpongeBob, right? So you know how SpongeBob been like canceling some episodes. They cancel they, they canceled that the the Penny Raid episode. Did they really? Yeah, because it was like not good I for children cuz he was children. like laughing yeah, at he, the things. Yeah. But there was supposedly an episode that aired in 2019 about like a quarantine what that the sick there was a sickness in like the Krusty mm-hmm. Krab and they had to quarantine mm-hmm. and they like deleted that episode. Why? Before, like before, I think I don't know if they deleted before or after the quarantine happened, or mm. they deleted it. Like the that episode aired before we went into quarantine, so mm. they deleted that shit. Mm. And I, niggas were saying that they're trying to. They, that's like the, the like you know how the Simpsons be foreshadowing. They're yeah, saying yeah, yeah. SpongeBob foreshadowed fucking the quarantine or something uh, like that. Yeah, they, I feel like that's just a coincidence. That's just a coincidence. But that's it's, it's that is a pretty weird co- coincidence, but that's a coincidence. But it's like if it was if it happened. But after quarantine, they would have left it up. Yeah. But like, why are they gonna like? Why are you just gonna delete that for yeah. if it already happened? Maybe it's like they don't want to scare people and say like it was a conspiracy, or whatever. Yeah, probably. You know how niggas, be? Yeah. niggas like me be. Yeah. But yeah. niggas like you. Bro. But hey, bro. Yeah. <coughs> Go do some pic. Do a picnic, bro. Nah, I know, bro. Listen. Get a frisbee listen. or or a football, or maybe some checkers or some or monopoly. Nah, I know. Listen, bro. Nah, I know what I'm. I'm gonna get some Connect Four, bro. Get some. Get some. Uh, There's a place in Montclair that overlooks like it's like a it's like a mountain. It's like Eagle Reservation. Like overlooks like a nice view. You can do that. That's where me and Jay went. Bro. Yeah. Get to, right. get the bug spray though. Get bug spray though. All right. Bro. So you you enjoy me, bro. I'm gonna do picnics, bro. You enjoy, bro. All right. I got a game we can play. Fuck. Top. Can you name the top ten costumes in the United States since this Halloween is Halloween costumes? Halloween costumes since this is a Halloween episode. All right. Easy. Go ahead. Scream. Nope. Okay, wow. Michael <laughs> Myers? Nope. What the fuck? What the fuck? Don't uh, think too specific. Not specific? Not too specific. Ghost. No. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, Frankenstein. Nope. Okay, there are some specific ones on here. What the fuck is going on? This is about to take forever. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so um, I'll say, um, I'll say, uh, what's what's that shit called? Fairy costume. Fairy, fairy's number five. Um, dang. Um, what else? Is there a uh, princess? Princess. Is that the same shit as fairy? Yeah, it's the same shit as fairy. Who's calling you? No, uh, Dom. Oh, okay. Oh, I haven't um, spoken to Dom in a while. Uh, what else? Uh, football player. Um, nope. Fuck. Soccer. Nope. Yo, what the? What's the word, bro? Um, you want some hints? Yeah. All right. There is. There's a superhero on here. Oh, there's a superhero. Yeah. Batman. Nope. Superman? Mar- uh, Marvel. Spider-Man. Spider-Man is number two. Spider-Man. Uh, give me... 
Get more hints, man. Oh, my fault. What is what is an animal that's like very small? I had a fucking I I, I had a feeling it was an animal. It, it has to do with like a, a certain holiday in the year also. This animal. Oh, like the Easter bunny? Yeah, like a like a rabbit. That's so what that's that's a, a rabbit. A is rabbit one is seven. Yep. A rabbit. Crazy work. Um there's another one here that is a DC character, but is a villain, and it's a woman. A villain DC character, a woman, Catwoman. Nope, close. Getting closer though. Uh, uh, is it? She's like the girlfriend of a very famous villain. She's the girlfriend of a very famous villain in DC <laughs> comics. Wait, hold on. I'm getting blanked. <laughs> I'm, I'm has to do with Batman. Oh, Harley Quinn. Harley Quinn is number ten. What the fuck? I ne- I don't be seeing. Yo, is it? The- okay, okay. Now I'm starting. To- okay, is there? Is there? Okay, never mind. These are kids, right? Kids, yeah, mostly kids and okay, adults. Okay, 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 and adults. So there's there's about one of them is like a is a Netflix show that you that you like to watch. That I like to watch. Yeah. A Netflix show. Yep. Specifically Netflix. Mm-hmm. It airs on Netflix. This is the most recent one, like recency bias, like costume probably. No way is it who I think it is. Who? Is it Jeffrey Dahmer, bro? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. no. No, no, no. Okay, because, <laughs> no, no. because nigga, I've seen people fucking... No, no, not, that not, nigga, just, not Jeffrey Dahmer. It's like, that's OD. It's like uh, you watched this when we was in Philly. Oh, wait. Which one? Vecna? Or is it Stranger Things? Stranger Things. But which one? I think it's just the kids 11? in general. Are you serious? This is number four. Niggas love Stranger Things. So you, so far you got two, four, seven, and ten. Start guessing away, bro. Oh, my gosh, bro. Th- um, think of like. Think of what you see on a at like a costume party. Okay, so I'll be seeing shit at the costume party? Yeah. Like a you, party? Yeah, think about that. Nurse, police officer? No. Uh what else? I'll be seeing motherfuckers dressed as like prisoners. Not prisoners, no. What the fuck is going on, bro? Think a little basic. Like what when you think of Halloween, there's devil, vampires. The, the devil. Nah, there's vampires, devils, there's werewolves. There's, it's it's it, the number one is a girl costume, a girl costume. Yeah. A nurse? No, not a nurse. Something with deal with evil. It's a very known Halloween thing. Wizard of Oz. A witch. A witch is number one. I don't be see- yo. What the fuck, bro? Yo, this is ass. Nah, this is a very hard list. This is hard. Okay, so. There's one where is there is there is there um all right go now what was you gonna say I was gonna say uh, fucking vampire but no no vampire no vampire that motherfucker like think crazy. of a keep going with costumes like what we what people wear as kids also is there also Power Rangers in that motherfucker nah too spe- too specific these ones are more like yeah basic. broad yeah you uh, got four more mummy. No mummy. You're getting close though. You're getting closer. You're missing one more. It has to deal with like a boat. A boat? Yeah. A sailor? Or what else is what else is a sailor called? I don't know. What is an evil sailor? Evil sailor? Yes. What the fuck are evil sailor? Jack Sparrow. Oh shit! What is what is that? What is he? A pirate. A pirate is number six. That's not an evil sailor, bro. The, the pirates are the evil sailors of the sea, bro. No, now you're missing three, eight, and nine. You got this, bro. <laughs> Yo, one of them. Is... One of them is an animal, but it's like, like you ever see those costumes where it's not like you wear it. It's like a blow up thing, and it looks just like that animal. It's like that. Is it gorilla? Close. You're getting there. Is it uh shit horse? <laughs> Not a fuck? horse. Oh, getting closer, getting closer. Getting closer. Um, it's a reptile. Oh, it's a reptile. Yeah. 
It's a fucking um an old reptile. Old reptile. What it's is not. It's you can't find these around anymore. What the fuck? Um, an old reptile you can't find around anymore. They're extinct. Yep. What is an extinct reptile? <laughs> I don't fucking know. <laughs> what is an extinct reptile we don't see anymore? I don't know. <laughs> Oh, a, di- a dinosaur? Yes, yeah, a dinosaur is number three. <laughs> oh, fuck. oh my gosh! Now he's Yo, missing eight and nine, bro. Think, bro. Now you're missing eight and nine, bro. One is a, a boy costume. One is a girl costume. A dinosaur, bro. Yep. Like, There's blow up dinosaur. You never seen them niggas with a dinosaur costume? They be on the head. Around? No, it looked like like it looks like an actual dinosaur. I never seen that. You definitely seen a dinosaur. Oh wait, yeah, yeah, but but niggas walk around like that. Yeah. Okay. Now you're just missing eight and nine. One's, one, eight is a girl costume. Nine is a boy costume. Okay, so I'm going to just bring out some. Think of the girl costumes. Think. They both have. They want. It has to deal with sports. For for the girl costume. It has to deal with sports. Dang, yeah. I said soccer already. But but think of. Think what girls would be in sports. Cheerleader. Cheerleader is number eight. And number nine. Is back to the old basics, the olden days, for the boys. Uh, this na- this is one. It's like a. It's an NFL team. I said football player. Right. Nah, it's not a football player though. It's a team NFL the, team. The, the NFL team is. This is what their mascot is. Oh, dang! This is what their mascot is. Dang, which one? Okay, so niggas got me thinking now, bro. Yeah. Uh, mascot NFL team. Like they're. Yeah, Giants, Green Bay Packers. Is it a motherfucking? You gonna get this one, bro? No, nah, I'm not, bro. You gotta get this one, friends. I believe. Bro. I'm not, bro. So I gotta think of all the NFL teams now, bro. Do your homework on me. It's in it's in Texas. Te- right, think bro. You think about it. It's in Texas. Shit, it's in Texas. Oh, a fucking cowboy! A cowboy is number eight, nine, bro. He made it through, friends. That was struggling. That was bad. That was a bad one. Because was, why the fuck would you do this? Like, who thinks about shit like that? Happy nobody. Halloween, people. No, nobody thinks about shit like that, bro. I'm surprised Vampire wasn't on here. That's why I'm saying Vampire, like Frankenstein. I've seen a couple Frankensteins, maybe. Maybe they they just too too hard to do. Or vampires should have been on there, bro. Hey, maybe they hate on vampires. Yeah, like I guess it's too cliche. I guess. Um, what else? Bro? Were you? What were you as Halloween for Halloween? Nigga, I ain't celebrating no Halloween. Bro. Uh, yeah, I forgot you didn't wear no costumes. I ain't wear no costumes, bro. I, I like, nah. You know, growing up, man, I'm I'm like I'm Haitian, so. I ain't really celebrate Halloween. I can Got do you. I, I'm older now. I can do what the fuck I want to. That's why he's dressed up as me. Yeah, now I'm dressed up as theirs today. But I might, t- yo, I might, I might dress, yo, I might dress up as some shit. What are you? What are you, what are you gonna be? Yo, it's just. A, all right, I'm just gonna tell you. Fuck mm-hmm. it. I might be my Morales. That's hard. That's hard. <laughs> I know. Wait, is your girl dressing up? It might be. Might be. Might be. Uh, what's her name? Peck. Gwen. Gwen. Ah. Uh, that's tough. That's hard. That's tough. Wait, That's still my idea, bro. Stop like, being I'm, weird, bro. Like I'm Peter Pan. Yeah, you guys are weird. Wait, why? You fucking dweebs. <laughs> the fuck? Like I said, I'm be Peter Pan, bro. Nigga, you know what Peter Pan did to kids, bro? He's, he kidnapped them. He took them to a better place. Better place? Nah, he kidnapped them. Bro. Hey, bro. Hey, bro. <laughs> so she wanted Tinkerbell? She wanted to be Tinkerbell, yeah. Dweebs. <laughs> fucking losers. <laughs> <laughs> hey, bro. Like, I'm Spider-Man. Did you, did you get the costume? Morales. Did you huh? get the costume? Nah, not yet. Uh, if you would have got the costume, you could have brought it. Would you have worn the costume on here? I would have worn it. Ah, oh, damn. I wish you would have. I, I would have worn it, but I, yeah. I mean, she she just sent the suggestion and shit, and I was just like, oh, shit, that'd be tough. So I said I might, you know what I'm saying? It might be something that I'm going to do. All you right. You know what I'm saying? That'd be hard. Imagine, you, imagine, nigga, you what? see me walking around, and nigga, it's been me the whole time, bro. I'm Spider-Man. This thing's a dork. <laughs> you talking about me? What the fuck? Nigga, like, are you going to like a costume party? Huh? You guys going to like costume party or y'all just get dressed nah, up? We just, uh, there is a some party that she did tell me about, but you go- I don't know if I'm going to go. I might go. 
Uh, you gonna if, go I, if I got a costume. Okay, because me. Like, and, I'm not gonna go if I don't got no costume. Like me and Jay, we going to her friend, her friend, our best friends having like a Halloween party at our house this oh, Saturday. Yeah. And you and you, Peter Pan. Yeah. Fucking dweeb. But I look cool though. I'm yeah, cool no, looking. No, look, I'm you cool can't look at Peter, Peter Pan, bro. Look cool. As I don't Peter got no Pan, tights. Bro. I got like the brown pants. My shit look cool. Oh, right. like it's not like I'm not like that's why I was like that's why I was afraid. I was like, yo, I hope I don't look stupid in this shit. No, right. yeah, I, I made sure I don't look like too crazy. Peter you got Pan. the hat too. Yeah, I got the hat. Yeah, it's not bad. It's not bad. <laughs> <laughs> but I want to talk to you about some shit. So I got some. I, it's not really a scary story, but it's kind of like a story I learned from I got from Joe Rogan, right? So I got a question to ask you. So do you believe that vampires was ever like a real thing in the world? No. What do you think? They got the vampires from. Uh, where do I think they got vampires from? Cause I think they got vampires from as like like the folklore. They got it from like serial killers that's going around, and they called them vampires because like they be killing niggas. And I feel like at over- night. Yeah, at night. I feel Is like I feel like there was a killer that was like killing niggas at night and not really drinking any blood, but like he was like a little deranged or whatever. He probably mm-hmm. do hella weird shit. And he probably looked at him, and over time, it started going to a point where it's like, oh, he's a vampire sucking niggas blood and mm. shit like that. I don't, I don't know. I just think. Yeah, where, where did they? Where did? Uh, because there I, are, like, I don't know if you ever seen in like Romania or whatever. There are like, like graves that have like traps on it. So are there? Because there's like, like they think they thought the vampires came back from the dead, so like they'll put like a a cage on it, mm. so like it can't you can't get back up. Okay. So, but I don't know. But so there was a guy on Joe Rogan, right? He was trying to explain to niggas like how there would be vampires. So basically, right? So you know how he would say vampires are like, you know how we are the advanced species on the world right now? Like we are the top of the food chain. Mm -hmm. So they said vampires would be above Above us. us. And like, you know how everything in the world has like a predator controlling the population. Yeah. Like we control like the populations of like deer or we, the the lions control, shit like that. So they were supposed they were supposed to control our population, but supposedly they like go dormant or whatever, and then we just spread. And that's why global warming's happening, overpopulation is happening. And they say like they come out every couple hundred thousand years, and that's why it seems like it's a myth because they don't come out enough. But that's why in history like there's like dips in the population, and they just say it's like a sickness. But they think it's like vampires running around killing niggas, and that's like they're like ten times as smart as us, and they're just hunting us down. Which I don't believe. That is one bit true. Yeah, I just think it's it's cool to think about. It is cool to think about. But it's like, think about it because like, what if there is something that's our like alpha that is above us? Because if you want to be real, like, there's nothing controlling us but ourselves. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, we're not, there's nothing else out there that's like controlling what we do, controlling making making us scared of shit. Yeah, but it's like, if there was, how would life be for real? Like, imagine you have to look around. You got to look around over your shoulder. You can't be in certain areas because yeah, you might fucking is, yeah, die. Yeah, because you might die. Yeah, because someone might be fucking hunting you down or some shit like that. That's crazy. And, That's crazy to think about. And think about how easy it is for them. Them niggas blend in. Yeah, they, yeah, because they look exactly like us. They look exactly like us. Nigga, you could bring home a girl. She a vampire. She kill you in your sleep. Yeah, but uh, what, the, what I don't understand is that, like, if there were vampires or yeah. some shit. Why would they? Not, why would they come out only a couple hundred thousand years? Like it that's doesn't why really they make sense to me. I think the 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 um this concept of immortality is just doesn't make sense. It is it's just not real. Bro. Think it's not possible. Immortality? No. Think about it. Think about it as like maybe not. There's a group of people, but maybe there's like two or three. And like they just roam around the world, travel the world. And that are the, immortal. They just don't die. Think about it like this, right? Say you're immortal right now, and you just keep like you can't, you don't stay in one place at one time. You just keep traveling, keep traveling. Nobody will ever know if you die or not. You don't make no. That's true. You don't make no relationships with nobody. That's true. And you just keep going around. And I and I completely understand that i see i can i i see i see how you could it's hide possible your, yeah how it's possible and you could hide your your immortality but i just I, everyone gotta die somehow bro everyone gotta die someday bro it's 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 a fact bro mm. it's a fact like it's just it's just something that has to be done bro you can't there's no one that could be immortal bro 
Immor- immortality. You can't skip death, bro. Oh, you can't. You can't cheat like, death. Cheat death. I you don't can't, think so. bro. See, that's what I'm saying. Like, that's why. I, that's why I can't believe in zo- in not zombies, vampires, uh, vampires because because of the immortality. Now, supernatural abilities, maybe cool, bro. Like, like magic and shit. Ma- yeah, magic and witchcraft or whatever shit like that. I mean, that. that is real. That's real. I believe in shit like that. But like, okay, because vampires are also, unless it's just the movies, they move fast. Is that is that just the movie? I don't. I think I, I, think, I think that's just the movie. I think they added that. I think yeah, vampires okay. just that they don't die. They drink blood and they can't like be out in the sun or whatever. Oh, so the out in the sun is still. It's, it's May, yeah, too. I think that's like one of them. And then like the garlic and steak or whatever. I just don't believe. Well, that 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 tr- that right there is. I, I believe like there's people who are like, I don't know, who just have this. Uh, who have natural abilities? Who I guess they're sh- they're smarter than us and shit like that, and they drink blood, whatever. There could be people like that, but I just can't believe that there's someone who's like that and just and just immortal. Mm. I just can't believe that. I just I just it's need immortal. to know where they base the the folklore from. Yeah, because why? Listen, bro. There's a lot of shit that they base. Like where where did they get the shit from? Like werewolves. Yeah, that's another thing. Um, what dragons, else? dragons. Like, where did they get this shit from? They have to base it off of something. I off mean, of something. Unless they're just trying, because that's what I'm saying. Like, you do, you gotta really base certain folklores off of something that, that happened, they've seen. something they seen or something they experienced. Exactly. So th- that shit just don't come out of thin but air. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Back in the days, bro, them niggas just used to be chatting. You think so? Yes. <laughs> like, <laughs> they were just chatting. Like, they was just chatting. Like them niggas. I don't know because. I've always said this. The weirdest shits, the weirdest shit that you could probably ever see or like anything could happen. It happened back in the day, bro. Oh, yeah, nah. They do. Like, th- them niggas, the, the weirdest shit. You bro. know why I realized they do be chatting? The Salem Witch Trials, bro. They be chatting. They really do be chatting. Like, like they, they just. There's like, no proof for nothing. There's they no just proof for nothing. They just, they just chat. Like, where did they, where? Like, come on, where did they get the concept of witch, witch at, bro? I mean, at the Salem witch yeah, trials. I know that, it was the eighteen. It was the eighteen. Eighteen. No, eighteen s- something. Like sixteen or seventeen. Sixteen. Sixteen something. Yeah, sixteen hundreds or some shit like that. Uh, where did they get the concept of witch? I don't know. I just think that's what I'm saying. I feel like it came from somebody that might have seen something, but like maybe they over exaggerated it. They, they yeah, they probably seen something that they never yeah. But what like they just uh, took a word and it's they just put it. They just gave it substance, and they just gave it gave it this bad negative shit to to where they could just blur it out to a female, and a female and niggas is gonna believe it. Mm-hmm. Niggas, niggas back in the day, bro. Like I said, shit, shit back in the day. The shit that happened, that's crazy shit that happened back in the day, supposedly. But there's a lot of them that <laughs> that them niggas just be bored, bro. I know, like they just be like. They just but be like, chatting. how does that shit just carry over? I mean, I guess it it's just, is boring it, yeah, back then. It's just, but they just carry over because I guess it was they just, nothing else it's to just do? more and more people who just, I don't know. How did they carry over? I, I don't know. It's just like word of mouth. Like shit just kept going. I don't know. Like, I just think from, if it would carry over, I just feel like because there's nothing else to do. So like you would just believe everything. But also, I won't take it to the fact there might be might have been people that might have seen something crazy. Yeah, no, they might, it might have happened. That. No, I believe that. Like, like, like I said, like niggas who went through like um, alien shit, like yeah, who had like that trauma. Shanks. That like, I feel like, yeah, that, it could have. Like, come on, because there's a there's a time. I mean, there's one time where. Like I guess it was like it was like four people mm. and they all had the same story. Yeah. Why all of them are lying? There's no way. Yeah, that's There's what no I'm way. saying. That's why so, I, certain and it, it makes it bad because there be there are some people that do fake it. So it's like you can exactly. never tell. You can never that's tell. That's why it's kind of good that that's why it's kind of good for I guess like what if the myth was true and like whoever is the myth like they will never know that that shit's real like if somebody's immortal. Mm. Like it's good for them because it's like you're so rare that like if somebody tells you like they see you and sees you do this shit, they will never believe you. Mm-hmm. Be- or like if they, they see you and they tell like other people, they will never believe that person that they seen it because like, it's just so rare to see mm-hmm. it. Nobody believes in that shit, yeah. which is a good thing. But yeah. like, Hey, I, there's out of all the folklores in the world that's ever created. There's gotta be maybe 
One or two. One or two. That is real. I say I say one or two. Which ones you think it would be? Um, not vampires. No, nah, I don't think so. Uh, what are what what are folk Bigfoot? Maybe. Probably one of them. I say dragons. Is is dragons? I say dragons. You know why you say I dragons? say dragons? Why you say dragons? Because there's so many countries and so many civilizations that have pictures of dragons. Okay. That's what I'm saying. Okay. But but that's because country them them shits I I don't know they they found I don't know I think it's cuz of the way dragons are portrayed as this big powerful you know creature creature yeah so I don't, I don't know I guess people want to first of all do you think do you think they're even that like they were that big Explain to me, bro. See, and they like, was flying around, bro. Do your homework on what the fuck. That, 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 that's not happening, bro. See, I just fuck think, that. right, if there's... I feel like they're trying to hide something. Just some past. Because I just feel like we learn... Like, what we learn is just, like, they want, it, they want us to follow whatever we learn. Like, oh, evolution, dinosaurs got extinct, whatever. But yeah. like I said before, there's always a possibility that something survived. Yeah. We never know. And they could have just killed them all off and just erased it from history. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Because think about it. That shit's in a, that shit's in Asian Asian cultures in the European cultures. That should be in uh I think it's in like like what's that called? The in like the north like North Pole whatever like in the the cold areas. I think there's something in like Africa like there's stuff everywhere about it. And it's like, where do they get this information from? And these dragons, like, this is not like it could be folk tale, it could be real, it could be just like a like a a ghost story somebody tells. But it's like, you could like you could hide that because I remember they was talking about like dragons. If they were dragons, their wings would have been equivalent to a bird's. So like, when they die and they become fossils, like the wings did like disappear. Yes, yeah. So niggas be like thinking like the dinosaurs we found. Could, like Where, some of them, I I, I heard about it. Could have been, but yeah. I don't know. I don't know if that's true. But I just think something. There's something behind it. I seen like a church, like th- like there's. I think there's like dragons in the Bible or some shit, in some page or like in some book. I forgot what book it is. There's like they talk about dragons and shit like that. Uh, I think so. And I remember there was like a a church, and like you know like they have like the pictures of like Jesus and stuff mm-hmm. behind the picture. It was like a fucking niggas fighting dragons and shit. Like it was like an old ass thing. They didn't know it was back there. Damn. So I don't know. They could like if it it would be either dragons or like maybe like ghosts and like you think ghosts and demons counts as folklore? No, nah, I think that's completely real. You think that's completely real? Okay. Hell yeah. So, I think I think that's literal that yes. Okay, how about um how about magic? Yes. I would think magic's real. I think magic's definitely real. I think all right, when I when I think of folklore, I'm thinking like like creatures? Like creatures. You think like um like are nah. Witches? The concept of witches that's real. That's real because I mean when you call a girl a witch like it's going to be like oh she does magic and shit like yeah, that like yeah. voodoo and shit like that. Like there's I think witchcraft. that's I think there's witchcraft in the world. Yeah, I think my so, mom's talking about my aunt did witchcraft. Wow. Yeah, crazy. Crazy world. Okay. Mom, if you're watching this, tell me about that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but yeah, so so there are witches in the world. But like, like cre- what what are mermaids? Mermaids. Mermaids? Yo, mermaids? Yo, honestly, bro. I wouldn't look past it. I wouldn't look past it. Bro, mermaids I think that's one of the most interesting shit to me. Like when it comes to folklore. You think so? Are mermaids. You know why? Why? Because not only, okay, so they said like they said from afar. Not only that, it's it's first of all, it's in the ocean. It's in the water. There's the ocean's huge. It's huge. You'll never find them. You you'll never find them. So so, the concept of from afar, I guess they look like us, and they look like I guess mm-hmm. sort of beautiful, and then they come you know closer when you come closer to them and. They like, kill you and stuff like that. Not even kill you. They I, I, they look completely said, different. Yeah, they look completely different. Like they like kind of scary and shit like that. And um, I guess they're uh, real infatuated, like with like jewelry and shit like yeah, that. Like, they, like treasures. Like treasures. That's why they go against like go after the pirates and shit. Yeah. So so the the concept of mermaids, bro. Because and it's not only that. It's on TikTok. 
all the time. Like, well, not as much as they used to be, but I used to see it on TikTok so often. Like niggas seeing mermaids. Yes, and well, like you, like you would hear, unless it's like good editing and like just like fake, like. Mm-hmm. Like have you, you just see- hear motherfuckers? You just hear like sounds. The sirens. Yeah. Have you seen that one where a nigga was driving a boat? That's and like the, the nigga about. was like they were like swimming on the side of him. That's what I'm like. What do you about. like? What do you call like, that? How, like how do you do that? How do you fake that? And like, it's, it's like, that's what I'm saying. And it's like it's crazy, right? So I think there there could be mermaids just for the fact because think about it as this, right? I said this before. I forgot what podcast. I said it like with Corey. There could be. Like, you know how we evolved from Neanderthals yes. to eva- to adapt to our environment yes. and we became yes. us? Yep. There could be people who? back in the day that evolved to the water Yes. because yes. who knows? And That's they start living in the water. Just like in the Philippines, there's people that live in the water. And like over the over years, they adapted to living in the water. Like they can hold their breath longer. Mm. They like take their ear, dr- they like take their, uh, their, they knock their eardrums out so like the water pressure doesn't bother them. Oh, and they literally that? live underwater. Oh, sure. And like over like I think couple generations, their kids start like developing like a little bit of webbing, web feet, a little bit, not even a little, but it's like you know a little more than us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's nothing crazy, but like and they swim, they can hold their breath a lot longer. Their lungs are bigger. I think their kidneys are a little bigger because they can hold more oxygen. Mm. And it's like that. That is evolution. So that mm. could happen where it could go underwater, but like the ocean's just so much so bigger. Much shit, and it's like think about it like this. I remember I don't know if I told you about this. They was talking about how mermaids. Like, you know how dolphins are always fond of us and, like, yeah. they're so playful with us? Yeah. They say because dolphins be with mermaids and we look like mermaids. Oh, Or man. mermaids look that's, like us. So they, so they make us think. That's weird. That's tough. That's what I'm saying. That's tough. Like, everybody, like, dolphin, like dolphins is one of the most friendly animals in the world. Like, they always help they, niggas they, out. They dickheads, though. Sometimes. Have you ever, have you ever, have you ever, you See know some that dick- dolphins, they be, um. Grabbing, like, ankles and shit? Yeah, they, uh, like. But they be they, playing they, around, though. Be Yo, there's some shit that I heard about dolphins that, like, they be wilding, bro. Like what? Like attacking people? Yo, bro, there's, uh, yo, you gotta see the facts of dolphins. I, I, got, I can't, I can't, like. Remember, oh wait, is it the, is that shit with? No, I, I seen some shit like dolphins are rapists or some shit. Like yes, that. <laughs> yes, them niggas be wilding. Like hey, they be bro. wilding. I don't know. They be ra- they be r wording motherfuckers. Like, I don't, I don't they be know. Tweaking, bro. That's wild. But like that's what I'm saying. Like mermaids, especially. Like I know, I I feel like a lot of like like the like the countries like on the islands like Haiti and things like that. And, like the oh those, yeah, they believe in that shit because that they're around the water yeah. a lot. So they probably seen some shit. Yeah, heard some stories. Yeah, bro, bro, come on, bro. If you if you be if you go to Haiti, bro, and you ask one motherfucker, are there mermaids? They gonna say yes automatically, bro. The real shit. I mm-hmm. think I asked my mom one time, bro. And she believes Somebody it. Somebody say yeah, yeah, bro. That's what I'm saying. Like I think my mom believes in a lot of stuff too because like she lived like in the Philippines. There is it is an island and there is a lot like especially the jungle. There's a lot of weird shit. Yeah. And I heard some shit about Haiti. Like I seen it on TikTok. They were saying like ask your Haitian like if you're if you have people or relatives that live in Haiti, ask them about like people turning into like animals or some shit. Like, oh, just, I know about that. So what is what is that? What is like what is that whole thing? Is that like they say like you could walk amongst Haiti, you see people turn into like cats or some shit. Like what I is don't that? know if they could turn like like right in front of you like but, like, but what is like what is like the whole folklore that I'm pretty sure it's like magic just like yeah like like I don't know I think there's this part of um part of Haiti like I'm I'm like I'm not like I haven't been there in that long so yeah yeah I don't know I'm not too too knowledgeable, too knowledgeable got about it got it, it. But, like I don't know, I know that there's. I think there's this part of Haiti. I don't know, like, like I get. You know how there's farming, there's farming parts. Like of, the back, back country. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where niggas don't go, bro. Really, is that bad? Like there, there. That's where the shits at. Like the 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 voodoo and all that shit. Really, Mama's, like turn into shit. Into some shit. <laughs> like you ever like, seen to that? Some, like, like a pig or some shit, a chicken. Whoa. Wow, bro, that's wild. <laughs> that's what I heard, but I don't, I you don't know. You think they just do that to scare people and not go back there? Huh? You think they just say that so so people doesn't go back there and they just scare them? Like, do you want to find out? Right, that's, that's what I'm saying. Thing, do you though, find like, out? like, that's the thing. Like, niggas, hey, if, if that's if that's the plan, it should work. Because like you seen like you seen that video of the motherfucker where his legs got turned into fucking like goats' legs. No, bro. I think I, I. I don't think it was in Haiti, but it was like maybe Africa or some shit. And I guess like the nigga like cheated on his wife or did something crazy, and like the 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 tribal shaman or whatever turned half of his body into like a goat. Oh no! I like did not like see from that. the bottom, it looked like, like he had goat feet. 
For real? Yeah, like he actually had goat like legs. It didn't look like editing. No, it didn't look like editing. Like he was like he was sitting down and like he was moving his leg like this, but it was like like hooves. Shit was wild, bro. <laughs> nah, bro. I don't know. Like that's what I'm saying. Like that, bro? The magic shit, I don't know, bro. The trans transformation shit, I don't know, bro. Like ah, uh, it's just it's just really weird. Like you know what it is too. Like it's like where where did people get that type of power from if that's if if that shit is for real like a thing Mm -hmm. where did people get that obtain power i would think it's like it's definitely something in like the deep darks of like the vatican or some shit like you know what the vatican is you know so the vatican is like the it's basically the small is the smallest country in the world but it's like it's basically it's like a city Mm. But it's a country because it's, like, run by the church. Mm. And they said, like, the Vatican got all the secrets to the world. Like, there's this big-ass library in that motherfucker that has everything from, like, from like inventions that Nikola Tesla made to, like, shit like magic things. Really? Like, it has, like, secret books. Like, if you have if you found some secret book, they, the Vatican's probably going to take that shit. So it's, like, I feel like niggas learn that. Because I feel like, I talk about this all the time. I feel like we are being, like... Limited, watch, you know, not even watch. Limited of what we could do, okay. Just because you yeah. know, shit, they don't want us to be too powerful, or whatever. Yeah, yeah. So that there is, there might be little spell books. There might, there might be little practices that you could perform to, to unlock certain things, mm. which one may be magic, but it might take a whole lot long no, time. Yeah. And you, we learn like, that's why niggas make us lazy, because they're like, oh, if they they don't if they wouldn't want to do this for this amount of time. We got we got to speed up their um attention span Mm -hmm. so like they don't freaking wanna they like they make us more lazy they make us like not interested in shit over time so it's like i feel like they do that on purpose Mm. in some scenarios but if anything i feel like there's like there's definitely like secret books or some shit like that yeah like some spell books because that shit is fucking crazy bro like niggas get turned into shit like like shape shifting like (laughs) like imagine like you fuck with a nigga like you, you you mess with a nigga and the nigga does some Imagine you mess with the wrong you. girl. She a witch. Yeah, like or like her dad like knows some shit or her mom knows some shit. That's like some shit in like the country, like the back country. Yeah, like, like West Virginia and shit. Like and then now out of nowhere, bro, you you will fucking turn into you a frog. A frog. Like you turn into an animal. Like imagine. Like imagine you turn into an animal and you thinking like, like how human? you think now. But you a fucking animal. I'm killing myself. I'm killing myself. There's no way. Like, no I, don't know what I, I don't know how I'm going to kill myself as a frog. How am I going to kill myself as <laughs> a frog? Just go to danger. Just jump. Yeah, I, yeah. I'm going to have to go in, like, the streets or something, bro. Just wait yeah. for a car? You wait for a car. That's what I'm saying. Like, it's like it's so ass. Like, like, like a frog. Like, really? You could turn into anything else, like bitch. Anything else, bro? Man, like, bitch, you, turn, you could turn into some shit I could fly at least. Yeah, at least, Let bro. me enjoy at least, like, a week of this. <laughs> Nigga, like, nah, you gonna, you gonna, we gonna change you something the way you wanna kill yourself. Yeah, that's crazy. What the crazy, fuck? Bro. Nah, that's some wild shit, bro. A frog turned me into a goddamn squirrel. Squirrel might be lit. Nah, fuck no. Squirrel, not. Eh. And you like, niggas will never know you, you got turned into a frog. Exactly. They just might think you're you missing. You can't communicate them, niggas, bro. They just oh, might think you weren't missing, bro. Hell, that's just, just crazy work. Wild things, bro. Wild things, bro. But, and I wanna, I wanna talk to you another thing that I read on, um, I seen on TikTok. So, I don't believe in this at all. But since we talk about shape shifting, do you believe in that reptilian shit that everybody talks about? Nah. Like there's reptilian people that's, uh, that's roaming us? around. Do you nah. believe that? I don't think I don't believe that either. And t- I don't believe that I don't believe in it either, but I seen this there was an article that was written in like the nineteen thirties, like LA Times talking about the the title of the article said fucking Lizard People's Catacomb City underneath the city. So, right, this is this is a whole article in the newspaper. I don't know if this is real or if this shit was like fake. So supposedly there was a there was an engineer that was like a geophysicist engineer. He used like radio waves to go like under LA to like see like what's under there and he found like tunnels and shit. Like giant tunnels of like a lost city or whatever. And he went to like a Native American shaman or whatever, like the chief, and he the chief told him like there's like supposedly like lizard people that went under the ground and made like a whole city and like the city's like for like 5,000 people and there's like ancient artifacts down there and it's like okay that shit sounds like a stretch but now you gotta think about it when people talk about there's lizard people all the lizard people is in Hollywood Beyond, they talk about Beyonce Taylor, all yeah. them niggas and it's like 
it it kind of do add up, but like I don't think it's a stretch like that because it'd be like they're saying like, oh, they came from underground and now they're among. That's why they create they created Hollywood, mm. and like that's like the mecca, like that's our influence, and like mm. they'd be like, oh, if we can shape shift into humans, they look up to us. We whatever we say, they doing that shit. Taylor Swift. Whatever them girls say, yeah, they go. That girl say they gonna do that motherfucker. Oh hell yeah! But, but I don't. Okay, think, so like, what is your whole thing about that? <sighs> Lizard people. Lizard people, bro. I just okay. It's, so so basically, what they're saying is that celebrities, celebrities are, are shapeshifters. Shapeshifters. <laughs> yeah, which is wild. Which is weird because don't motherfuckers. Like that, don't they got like baby pictures? They do got baby pictures, but like what if they that, what if they AI that? Nah, bro. Think about because it. Because think about no, you think about it, bro. We seen Beyonce ever since she was getting okay. up. Yeah. How can that even be? A you thing? know what they say? What they, they say, say, bro? They say they take them and as switch, they're younger, or like they like switch them out. Like you know, remember they be saying they clone Can't motherfuckers. Be, bro. Yeah. And like they take they take them away. Maybe when she turns like when she's about to be famous or when she just got something famous, gets kidnapped, switch with the motherfucker that shape just just looks just like her. You never know. I just can't believe in it. I don't I can't believe in it either. Cause I it's just be, like I can't believe in it. I just can't believe why lizard people too. Like that's, that's so what I'm saying. That's specific. Just, like that's mad. Just, like it's too weird. Weird. Like and uh as far as them living beneath us. Yeah. It was in Hollywood or something. It was like, like underneath LA. I just can't believe it. I think it's possible for. I think there's possibility Whoa. for like. For what? Like underground cities that we never found yet. Really? You gotta think about it like this. They be finding cities underground in like Europe all the time. Like that hold like, like maybe two thousand people. Yeah. Bro, there's like in Mexico, there's a population of like Chinese people that live underground. Are you serious? Yeah, because they supposedly, like, I guess they got, like, shunned out by, like, the Mexicans or whatever. They didn't like them or whatever. They was like, all right, fuck it. They just started digging on the ground. Now they got, like, little, like, caves and shit like that. Just, like, a whole little, little population, like, maybe a thousand people, like, a little city down there. Wow. Like, I think it is possible. Like, there is, we find underground cities, like, every couple months. Like, yeah. like of, like, ancient ruins or whatever, like, yeah, caves. But the, but the, but the, but lizard people, bro. That's what I'm saying. Lizard believe, people. I just I don't can't know. believe that lizard people are an actual thing. Like, like how? Ha- like. That's what I'm saying. But if anything, to where, to where, like, I get it. That I get that we, like, they look just like us and shit like so that. So it's hard to like. To to fake. yeah to yeah, but how? Like we couldn't see. We can't see any signs of them. I mean, they. Do, you ever seen them shits that they post on like when they let the eyes? Like, Yo, turn that's shit? so editing. I've seen so. I've yeah. seen all of that shit. Like, mm-hmm. and, and trust me, when I was a kid, I'm like, oh shit. Yeah, me too. That I Beyonce think I seen, shit. Yeah, bro. I think I said like Beyonce, but Beyonce one, a Katy Perry one, maybe yeah. a Justin Bieber one. Bro, I seen all that shit. I'm like, oh shit, when this I, is crazy shit. Mm-hmm. Now <laughs> it's like you can you can edit that now, especially with AI. But I no, I ain't gonna lie. I did see this one video though. It was like it was like a security camera, and I guess there was like a it was like two guys walking down a, a street at nighttime, and the guy was like I guess one of the guys was like fainting or whatever, so the guy went to go help him. The nigga like transformed into some big shit. He looked at him like he's like what the fuck? It was some crazy shit. Like he like you seen him like turn into something weird. Like it didn't look like human. Like really? his back was like hunched over, and the nigga ran away. I'm like nah, what what like I don't know if you can edit that because it's like a security camera footage unless you're really nice. With the edits, niggas do be nice. Though, niggas but, do be but nice, but it's like that's I don't know. Still crazy. When though. I seen that, that was when I was like, you know what? There might be something. I don't know what it is. Yeah. Shape shifting. I don't know. That's like the one thing. Like I like I don't know if you watch you watch them Young Justice and shit. Yeah. Well, no, that's, not like you're not gonna see, like you're not gonna see me watch it. Like remember, you talk about like Bane. No, nah, not Bane. There was like um, you ever you don't remember the Reach or whatever? No. Like there was like a like so like for Young Justice, like I'm watching it over again. Mm-hmm. There's like a group of aliens that's been amongst the humans mm. the whole time like they've just been hiding or whatever and like they came out at a specific time where niggas don't like the justice league and they 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 brought they introduced themselves to the eight to the humans and it was like yeah it was like when randall savage or whatever like brainwashed the justice league and mm. they was like going on a tear or whatever and like the aliens they came in as like oh yeah your superheroes are bugging right now but we're the real 
we're the real like oh, heroes. Real like because like everybody's scared of like Superman and shit like that now. But like now you see real aliens, they're like, oh, like these guys is nice. Like they start making like food. They start making food for them, like drinks, like energy drinks. Like it's called the Reach Energy Drink. But the whole time their whole plan is like trying to yeah. to, to take over, and they've been here for like years. Oh shit! So it's like, but like that, that's what I'm saying. Like it could happen. I don't know. I don't. I don't know if like there will be a time where niggas will come up to us and be like, "Yo, we are aliens. Like we come in peace." I don't know if that's gonna happen. Like in my lifetime, I hope it do. I hope it, I hope it does too. I'm not gonna lie. Just uh, just for me to be like, "Dang, it was right. It was all tough. true." Yeah, but uh, I feel like the, when the, when the time it will come is like when we're like at our at most like bottom tier. Like maybe not bottom tier lowest, but like lie. when we're just like. It's gonna be. It's gonna be when we don't trust something. When we, when we, I think that one thing gonna be when we like shit. Like, old as hell. Old as fuck. There. You gotta think about it though. Like we're really living in the future for real. We really are. Like we're like if you gotta think about, it, we got the Apple watches that we looked at when yeah. we were kids. We got we got fucking drive, self driving cars, cars and we got fucking FaceTime. There's, think about it, bro. So much shit, bro. No, but. Think about it, bro. Yeah. We have self-driving cars now. Mm-hmm. We have, like, AI-generated shit. Yeah. We have robots. Uh, not Robot the, delivery not, not people. crazy shit. But, but something. Some shit. How do you think the world... We're we're, we're pretty old now. We're, mm-hmm. we're getting there. Yeah. How do you think we're going to be... Uh, the world's going to be, bro. What, 20 like years? Like, until we... Yeah, like, 20 years. Like, until we get, like, self Not self-driving. Flying cars, you know how shit was supposed to be, like oh we're gonna get flying cars this, this, like, yeah. this year. Like we've been, we probably been was supposed to get that shit. Yeah, yeah. See, how do you think that shit's gonna be? Like, how you think, or when do you think we're gonna get that shit? See, I just I don't think we could get flying cars because it's it's gonna be hard to traffic that in the air because yeah. we already got we already got planes to worry about. Oh yeah. But I do think that no, but. I mean, planes are further high. Yeah, but it's like you, now gotta you gotta like, you gotta put traffic lights in the sky or some shit. Yeah, there's, that's crazy. There's, it's, it's, there's something they they might figure it out. But what I think will happen maybe twenty years is something like everything's gonna be automated. Mm. Like, I feel like twenty years like we're gonna have like ele- all electric cars. Everything's gonna be automated. Every, there's gonna be a lot of touchscreen shit. Touchscreen TVs is gonna be a thing mm. in classrooms. Remember, remember the smart board? We were so hyped to see that shit. Yeah, I feel like there's gonna be an even like bigger one, yeah. like where it's like just a lot more tech. And I feel like it's because like the kids now are learning a lot more technology than we ever did. Like these niggas learning coding and shit, bro. Yeah. So I feel like they're gonna figure out a lot more shit where it's like, oh, I also think they're gonna be. There's gonna be a lot of imitation foods and shit what do you mean like i feel like the food source is gonna go down mm. and they're gonna make a lot of like oh this is fake shit fake shit but it's gonna be like busting look good <laughs> it's gonna be rocking yeah but we're not gonna care because it's like it's like it's gonna be like they're gonna figure out some shit like that to solve the hunger problems or whatever yeah but and i'm trying to think what else what are not even 20 years bro there's like 50 years to nigga, go by, maybe like, like five you seen what they're doing in abu dhabi and shit like that them, that new city that's like all fully automated whatever no nah. they're making like a big ass city that's like in like a line and what? it's like fully automated look like the look like the jetsons bro really yeah they just started building it wow it's like 30 it's like 20 miles long it's just a straight line like it looks like a look, look like a big ass wall Damn. it's just crazy bro but i don't know i feel like what do you think is gonna happen in the future like what do you think is the one thing you're gonna see in the future yeah uh, i never honestly believed in the flying car shit Mm-mm. but um i do believe like you yeah like when it comes to like robots and like oh yeah you're gonna see robots. a whole bunch of fucking robots like like a lot of motherfuckers i don't know if they're gonna lose do you think i right, that too Working, are we gonna we're gonna lose our jobs too. Are you think people are gonna be lo- like working as much, like losing their jobs, or because at the end of the day, bro, people, we need money. Like, mm-hmm. the, like is the economy gonna be like the same? Like, now that I think about it, because niggas are robots are doing hella shit right now. Th- still, that's what I'm saying. See, the, right now, I think they're gonna take over. I would hope they're taking over like the more. 
dangerous jobs like war. Like yeah. I heard, bro, I heard on Joe Rogan <laughs> like war. Yeah, like 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 soldiers and whatever. Niggas gonna be soldiers. Bro, I heard Joe Rogan was talking about like they made a robot. It's called like Eat RX or whatever, and it literally like its fuel is eating like dead bodies. Like what it'll go on, it'll, it'll go on the battlefield and like consume like whatever dead body. That shit just makes it go and just start shooting shit up. What the fuck? And like I would think, I would think there would be like. Like Uber, I feel like Uber is gonna have like self driving like Uber cars. Uber like, cars, like, like no one in there. Yeah, nobody in there. You just call them up. I'll be scared as fuck though. Like hell yeah, I'm I'm scared. As like fuck. I can understand like our parents and our grandparents be scared of the shit that we do. Yeah. Like the like the FaceTime and shit like that. Like I don't yeah. want to do all that shit. Yeah, yeah. I can understand. Like, I'll be scared of like, hopping in an Uber. With no nigga, what? With no nigga in that the nigga could just drive. kill me. Yeah, that's scary shit. That's one death, not two. Yeah. Like what the fuck? <laughs> That nigga could just the, the robot could just be like fuck it malfunction like nigga we off the road now exactly that's now crazy. I'm flying nah that's nah yeah, that's bro. crazy I'll never trust that shit I would never nah I, I would be scared I, that's what I'm saying I would not call like that's that's why some people don't be doing like Uber drives they still do taxis and yeah, shit yeah yeah they don't do shit that like are the norm now because mm-hmm. you know it's it something right. that they're not used to exactly so like, that's what I'm saying like I I feel like that. Is what we're going towards. I'm gonna be one of those mo- old motherfuckers. I bro, am too. I'm that that's not gonna do like the shit that the younger kids doing. The younger kids doing just cause they doing it, bro. Because it's like that. Nah, I'll be like, yo, back in the day, we ain't do this. We shit. ain't do that shit. I drove. <laughs> I <laughs> drove, bro. I took the bus. <laughs> yeah, bro, oh shit. yeah, the bus is gonna be automated. Automated buses. Hell yeah. Yeah, bro. Automated buses. Automated Ubers. Planes. Hell no. There's they, they, you gotta have a nigga. You gotta have a person. You gotta have a nigga flying. That's too much. Boats, maybe. For cargo, maybe. Are you scared to see what the future looks yeah, like? Yeah, no. Because I feel like the future is going to help. There's going to be ways to help me out and shit with shit like that. Like Especially what? AI technology. I feel yeah. like AI is going to help me do my job a lot better than how it is. And I just feel like I, I just feel like it's scary because it's now like we're putting too much trust into, into a machine that yeah, we just built yeah, yeah, robots. instead of ourselves. That's what yeah. I'm saying. That's why I'm telling niggas like niggas is becoming lazier mm. day by day. Mm. Nigga, because everything is done for you. You don't got to go pick up your food. You could, somebody going to do it for you. And eventually a person not going to do it. It's going to be a it's motherfucker like a robot drone. to do it. Yeah. A drone going to drop off your food. So it's like, that's just where it's bad. Cause like imagine, right. They put us at our laziest, our laziest point and some shit go wrong fuck we gonna do we not we lazy bro we lazy as fuck like they just they like like our fight or flight mode is gone yeah bro we got no instinct no nothing that's what i'm saying no instincts is gone like i just feel like we're just losing all that i just don't want to that's the one scary thing i feel like will be bad like me bro me i'm scared you think you are hell yeah because it's like it's like it's like damn like what the fuck like it's like it's just I don't know what the future is going to look like. That's yeah. what's scary to me. That's what I'm saying. Like, what if it goes a whole different direction to where I see it as? Mm-hmm. As in, like, you know, like, yeah, you see robots. But what if it's, like, some... What if it's worse? It's worse. Like, See, what that's, I think it would be worse if, like, if... Because I, I believe history does repeat itself. Yes. And, like, think about it. A hundred years ago, what were we using? Recession, exactly. depression, depression, all how that. How to get shit. out the depression? World War Two. Exact. That's exactly what I'm saying, bro. Think about because think, because can't can't them having robots taking niggas jobs start a depression? Niggas don't niggas don't got the jobs to make money and shit mm-hmm. like that. They then they gotta go to war and shit like like. I think about extra, it. extra shit, bro. World War One was like what 1920s? Niggas 2020. Shit. Nigga, shit going left already. Going left, so we bro. don't like that's what that's what scares me, bro. Like that's like history is repeating itself too much. Mm-hmm. No, <laughs> no, relax. Let's 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 rewrite another history. Let's rewrite something else. When shit goes worse, don't go back to old actions. Let's let's recreate. Let's create new shit. Exactly. And I don't, I don't know, bro. Like I don't even know who the fuck our next president is gonna be, bro. Exactly. Who the, like that's what I'm saying. When, I don't bro, even know who the candidates are. That's me neither. <laughs> Isn't the election like what next year maybe? Type shit. It's in November, don't it? Isn't Nigga, what did Joe Biden do? But just promise student loans back and not and just keep taking away. He'd be like this. I forgot that nigga was even the fucking president. I know that old motherfucker. That nigga, they do shit. I ain't gonna lie. I don't think he really running shit for real, bro. Nah, there has so. to be somebody else that's running shit. So, oh, because group of niggas I running. haven't seen that nigga. I don't even be seeing that nigga in memes. In memes. I, that's all. He's a joke. 
He's a joke. He's, li- he's li- that's what I'm saying. He's literally the perfect puppet. Yeah, I haven't seen that nigga talk one time, bro. He's literally the perfect puppet. Like if there was a if there was like a secret group, whatever that's controlled, whatever. Has to be. Joe bro. Biden is the perfect puppet. Has to nobody be. knows. Has to be because he don't say um, shit. do you ever hear him talk, bro? He stutters yo, everything. I, he barely I, knows what to say. I, yo, I've heard him only talk one time, and yeah, it was because he was stuttering. He barely don't know what like he don't know what he's talking about most of the time, which I do feel like it's our fault. The nigga's eighty years old. Nigga's old. As nigga's shit. old as dirt. Yeah. But I mean, like, who else? Him or Trump? Uh, I just, I, but yo, imagine, imagine a world Trump is like speaking the truth, trying to save us. We'll uh, never know, though. Fuck you it, never know. It's, it's, it's not, know. it's not your fault. I, I mean, I, I think he's running though. But I know still, that but shit. That shit. I used, like, just, I used to like Trump, bro. You did. When, when I, I, ne- I, I never, I never really cared. Yeah, during wrestling, was he was in time. wrestling. I never really cared, bro. I, I didn't even think that nigga was like a billionaire until like recently. I'm like, what? Wait, I've always seen him like in movies. Like yeah. the nigga was in. Uh, Home Alone, yeah, yeah, I think so. And yeah. I'm like, and, and I'm like, okay, like what the fuck? I didn't know what he did. I didn't know what he did. And then now he's just this anomaly, like this, our president. this, this, yeah, president. I'm like, what the fuck? After Obama, I just feel like shit just went like. Yo, honestly, bro, shit honestly, just hit the fence. like yo, niggas used to sit on the TV watch Obama speak and shit like that. Niggas don't care about what Joe Biden is or talking Donald about. Trump did. That's what I'm saying. The last two presidents, like, I maybe it's just like you know what? Maybe it's because we got an older. We're starting to realize like this shit is really this is a joke. Yeah, joke. Yeah. Because my yes. parents did. I remember I did a report in second grade about like jo- George W. Bush. My mom was pissed. Oh, for real? Cause I heard like he was like a fucking. He was a dickhead. He was a dickhead. Yeah. That nigga was bad. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm saying. I, I didn't know that though. Yeah, but that's what they don't tell you. They tell me, bro. That's that's exactly. The motherfuckers tell you. All they tell you is that he was our first president. He 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 found America. He led. He was a great uh, leader, general, lead general, whatever, whatever the fuck it was. The nigga was a dickhead. Yeah. The nigga. The saying. nigga used slave teeth. Yeah. Nigga George was, Washington. Yes. Yeah. That's nigga what I'm saying. Was, nigga was not a good person. Oh, you said George Bush or George Washington? George. I said George W. Bush. Oh shit. Yeah, he's going with George Washington. You tweet. <laughs> I was. I let you slide George though. Washington. I was gonna let you slide, bro. I, I wasn't gonna stop your shine, bro. Yo, I was going with George Washington. I was just thinking of George Washington. But anyways, yeah. Then, uh, yeah. Oh, wait, why George W. Bush? Why was she tweaking about him? You know, all the 9-11 shit. Oh, and, like, yeah, 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 he's yeah. really secretive with shit. Yeah. And, like, even the Clintons. I heard the Clintons, like, ran shit like the mob, bro. Do you know why? Um, Remember he got, like, hit by a shoe? Like, a, uh, I think it was a military person. Like, he threw a shoe at him. Who? George W. Bush. And you don't was he in the Army or some shit? Wait, wait. I don't. No, I don't know. That's he was a speed. He was doing the speech. Oh, oh, and I oh, think, I think oh. the mother threw a shoe at that boy, bro. Well, I mean, I guess why? why? He, the nigga's probably an asshole, bro. Yeah, he probably didn't help shit. He probably wasn't doing shit. That's what I'm saying. I don't know. But I wasn't paying attention to like because we was too pods. young. Yeah, we were too young. We, we was literally in elementary school. Yeah, we didn't really understand president until the black guy was there. Yeah, that's Not true. Not even gonna lie. That's true. That's what I'm saying. If, if like, no, no. Keep it being. If Obama wasn't black, were we still like? Appreciate oh, no. him as much? No, real shit, bro. Definitely not. Real shit, bro. Bro, the whole, whole the whole thing was first black president. Mm-hmm. That's it. And that and yeah. that that I mean I mean I'm gonna be honest with you. Yeah, that's a huge deal. That is a it is a huge deal. But, but it's like at the time, like that's all we knew him for. That's all we knew him for. We didn't know nothing else. Nigga, <laughs> like songs was 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 as soon as Obama got nigga was like my president is black. My land blue, like yeah, shit like, like that, like niggas. That was that was it. That's my president, but like a black president. No one give a fuck what what, him, he, did. what he did, bro. Exactly. Like it could, like he could have, he could have ruined. The, oh yeah, he was black though. Like a black yeah. president. Like if he would, if we would have declared war right now, we'd be like, yeah, we'll fight for that motherfucker. Yeah, hell yeah. Not me though. <laughs> no, not me. Not me. But but it's it's just because he was black. Hey That's man, it. that's it's, really it, bro. That, if you if, know if this, it was white, bro, no one. You know what that means? We need more black people in office. We do. Amen, bro. Amen, we do, bro. We do, we do. All right, bro. I got a, I got a question now since we're talking about that, right? So, would you accept a billion dollars? But the circumstances is you must bring back slave you must bring back slavery for one random race in the world. No. You want to do it? No. You want to do it? No. <laughs> no. You want to do it? No. A billion dollars, Fritz. A billion, bro. One is random good one ra- bread. one random race. They yeah, don't got it. It could be mine. That could be black. It might not be black. It might be the white people. What if it's the white people? That's like what? Like one out of what? Four chance? One out of Maybe six, seven? I don't know. Listen. Listen. Mm-hmm. I'm going to be honest with you, bro. 
I wouldn't even put slavery on onto nobody? white people. I wouldn't either. With that billion dollars, I'm going to help them. Wait, wait, what? With that billion dollars, I'm going to help them. <laughs> so, fuck? You, so you're putting... A billion dollars? So you're putting them into slavery, and you're going to help them with I'm that running, billion. I'm running that shit like it's the U.S. We take these slaves, you want to be honest. We are. We're modern. It's modern day slavery. Exactly. That's going to be modern day slavery. I got bread. But, but listen, bro. Nah, you, I don't think you could help them, bro. I could help them. It's slavery. I'm not whipping them. You know them. how many people... Wait, but does it doesn't mean you're running it. I could run it. I got a billion dollars. I could find a you way. You got a billion dollars. But I there's save also a good motherfuckers who, who got money too, bro. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going I'm to save the good people. The bad people go in the, go in the field, you're bro. You're chatting, bro. Why not? You're chatting, Why bro. Why not, Fritz? Bro, bro. Why not? I wouldn't wish slavery on I no type of I wouldn't wish slavery race. on nobody. Of course I would not. <laughs> <laughs> I would not, said, of course I would not. <laughs> I would not wish slavery on but my worst could, enemy. But you're gonna get that billion dollars. A billion you're gonna dollars wish, is a lot you're of gonna, money. You're gonna wish for that slavery and help them the good people. Because I know damn well a lot of these people gonna put me in slavery. Hell yeah, nigga. What? Get back, gang, bro. Fuck that <laughs> shit. Nigga, what? <laughs> is this is not just for me. Yeah, this nigga switch. You because nigga switch? I'm just being fair. A you billion dollars? You know, that's I'm, good bread. That's good bread. A billion dollars? That's amazing. That's a million millions. Yeah, but. That's a million million dollars. <laughs> a million million dollars. <laughs> but there is, that is slavery. It's not like, it's not like we're tormenting them. We're just going to give them jobs. And work for me. No. Slavery. You didn't, con- you didn't, you did that's not, I'm you saying. did not be specific. Slavery is just like, you. <laughs> You're trying to, you did not be specific. When I thought of slavery, I thought of what the 400 years we had to go through, bro. I mean, if you want to do that, go crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not doing that to these folks. <laughs> now you're cheating. How's that cheating? You got to, you got to talk about They still what, work for me. You got to talk about what, what Whatever I do. say, they do it, but I'm still nice. I'm not going to, I'm not going to be, I'm not going to wild out. I ain't going to make them work long hours. They're going to work nine to five. <laughs> they do this anyways. Chris, that's what I'm trying to tell you. They do this anyways. What the? Bro, f- so you're not being a slave, bro. You're not being a slave owner, bro. Bro, this modern, like you said, did. modern day that's slavery. That's not what they did, bro. I didn't say that type of slavery. Nah, you're cheating, bro. So you're what, Oh, be, so now you would do it? it? Yeah. If that's the case, <laughs> what the fuck? Look, that's what I'm you, saying. You're, 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 I'm thinking, nigga, well, I didn't think I was going to be a slave. Say you got, you got a butler. I didn't, think, butler. I didn't think I was going to be a slave owner. I thought I thought you was talking about just uh, like they become Yeah, they become slaves. slaves but now I didn't think I was going to be an owner. Well, you got to have to be. You're going to well, be one. Well, yeah, but okay. Okay, yeah, I, I am going to have to be. But I mean, I just thought like them niggas would be going through what niggas went through. I mean, I, they, that's, all, that's I mean, all I thought about. When I think some about of them... <laughs> <laughs> Not the ones that I take care of. I'm gonna be a good person. <laughs> Some of them. Like niggas, like the bad. I told you the bad ones might have get. That's like prison. Yeah, it's literally like prison. It we are living prison. in modern day slavery, and now I get a billion dollars. It is prison, bro. You know what I'm saying? That's literally prison. They're literally doing what the slaves did. Oh my god. Like, you know what I'm saying? I might do it though. Type shit. Now, if you. <laughs> all right. So it's gonna be. So what if? All right. So what if? Right. This is for your life. For your life and your family's life, you have to be a slave owner back in the days. Oh, my God. Your life and your whole family's life. Your mom, dad, brother, sister, girlfriend, they lives at stake and your life. So I have to be a slave owner. Slave owner for five years. Five years? Yeah. Back, and then you come back. It depends what, 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 what type. Uh, you are I can be a good slave. That's what I'm saying. You can be a good slave owner. But now, but that's what I'm saying. Would you do it? Yeah. Would you buy they would you buy they freedom? Yeah. What if it's bread though? What if what? What if like what if like all your slaves' freedom is like how much is in your pocket? Oh shit. <laughs> but do you we need to keep some? <laughs> you gotta keep some niggas. You know what it is though? <laughs> you know what it is though? He said, oh, I think I'm talking. <laughs> yeah, I got a guy can keep some guy. Yo, yeah, you a good guy. You know what it is though? <laughs> a lot of slaves did not well. I'm not gonna say they didn't, but they didn't have anywhere to go after they 
That's you what know, I'm bought their freedom. First of all, they didn't know how to read or write. Yeah. They didn't, which people took a lot of advantage of them. Oh, yeah, Because no, I'm, they didn't know how to read I'm or teaching write. them everything. They yeah. Go, they like my kids. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, and they didn't have any shelter. Uh-huh. I mean, they didn't have no, nowhere to go. So, a lot of them, I, per, I, I think a lot of them low-key didn't want to go. Or didn't want their like freedom bought. Probably because they just didn't just know. Just because they didn't know what else to do. Like yeah, I get you. Like some of them were not only that they were accustomed to the shit that they were going through, and they was like, "Damn, I'd rather have this go go. I'd rather go through this than be like I don't know what else yeah. I'm gonna do. Like just but nothing. Me, me, yeah. I'm gonna be a good slave owner. Oh hell yeah, nigga! I'm gonna I'm gonna teach him how to read. Like right? I don't know if I'm a like I'm pretty sure they're gonna love me. I know. I might attract they're, some more. Yeah, they're gonna they're gonna like yeah, my slave my slave. So this oh, wow, this is crazy. <laughs> Hold on. My people I'm not gonna call them slaves. I'm black my people. I'm still gonna be black. Yeah, I'm can't still be gonna white. be black. Yo, my people gonna I'm gonna be the talk of the town. Nah, that's what I'm like, saying. Like, hey, come over here, bro. I'm gonna have holiday breaks. Yeah, I'm gonna bro, have shifts. We, we go four hour shifts. Yo, You're not working ten yo, hours, you're working four. Basically, Niggas is talking about jobs working. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> this is literally what we're doing. Yo, that's what I'm trying to tell you, Yo, bro. I know, bro. It is, bro. Bro, it I'm going to... And think about, about it, right? Is, now I'm going to have the biggest business in the country. Because now I'm going to... I'm going... My, my, they're going to be... This, oh, why this is so wild. Did, why didn't... Pe- yeah, this is so wild. But why didn't... They, my, yo, there's there's some races back in the day. They, they could have made bread. I know. They're bugging. They didn't like, understand. They wanted to be dickheads. For no reason. For no reason, just because of the color of their skin, instead of being a cool nigga to where they could bring more. Attract more. But like, yo, I want to work for I you, man. I love you, you, man. Yeah, like you, you. Niggas like, do that now. They do that. The fuck? Like, come on, bro. Niggas, niggas, niggas wasn't thinking, They bro. wasn't thinking. Now you got now you got the smartest and the best people working. Nigga, that's what and, Nike's and, doing right yeah, now. Now you got, you got, you got. Google. Smart. Yeah, you got smart. You got smart slave. Like, you teaching her how to read, right? Now you got niggas who... Who gonna venture off and do some shit and, and do better? And now they are gonna bring people. Bring, bro, this is this this is what I learned in HR, bro. That's literally what I learned. <laughs> this is literally what, training, training builds confidence for them to do the work well. Yep. And if they want to leave, word of mouth, uh, word of employee mouth. referrals. Yep. Bring them in. That's yep. what Google does. Yep. Nigga, come on, bro. Niggas wasn't thinking like how you were thinking, bro. bro Niggas wanted the, to just. I'm be the greatest, bro. Niggas, bro. I know they just want to whip them. And call them, call them names and make them do all the extra shit. Nah, bro. Be, be good people, bro. I'm going to be a cool slave owner, bro. I'm going to be the best one on the block. But they going like, to know bro. me. The other slave owner is going to hate me, bro. I'm inside, telling you, bro. Yeah. All these slaves going to run away to my crib. Yeah, no cap, bro. <laughs> them niggas going to... And I'm going to be like, hey, cuz, you want to be a dickhead, bro. I'm That's your like, fault. And then I hopefully... I'm come inside, bro. Hopefully, we got yo, eats. eats, bro. Welcome, open arms, <laughs> open bro. Open arms, bro. And hopefully, my positivity and kindness will rub off on other other slave owners. Yeah, that's a fact. See, look, this look how we just made slavery into a positive that outcome. That's crazy, bro. <laughs> <laughs> what are we doing? <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, that is crazy, bro. All right, bro. Let me let me do another question, bro. What are the questions I got? Oh, so Elon Musk is giving you fifty million dollars a year, but every year for the rest of the life, you have to survive a random person trying to kill you. Would you do it? You said fifty million dollars a year. Uh, yeah, fifty fifty million. Uh, nah, just fifty million straight. Oh, damn. Straight. Fifty million straight. You think that's worth it? And every year. Every year. No. But once you kill the nigga, you good. Or if you, you call the cops. <sighs> I don't think I don't think fifty million is gonna hold me up though. It's not gonna hold me up, and that's my life. That so is your life. If so, like, random. what if somebody asks? What if it's a kid? Like it's like a little Chucky motherfucker. He come out my door. Damn. First, Man, I'm, I'm kicking. I'm first, I'm gonna call the cops. Fuck out that I'm gonna have surveillance cameras all around. What? Just in case, cops. like niggas go. No, just in, no. I'm just saying, just in case, like niggas think I murdered him. Like, nah, he tried to kill me first. Oh, right, this twelve year old got the boot to the face oh, for right. a reason. Yeah, no, nah, that's fact. I got my like. I'm gonna have my guns. I'm gonna get like. I'm gonna have like security on deck. You know, mm-hmm. type shit. I think I, I'll do that. Fifty fifty million dollars. Yeah, I can yeah. do that. It's gonna be. It's gonna be a little difficult. I might get caught yeah, lacking. Because what if it's some shit, what nigga, bro? What if it's a drive by? Now I'm fucked. Yeah, now you fucked. Now you don't even, you can't even you can't even splurge on the fifty million. I know that shit over. Yeah, it's over. I you would dead. just hope I, I I like get rid of the nigga like the and it's first every month. year. That's crazy. I would just hope I get rid of them in like January, February. So like the rest of ten months, I'm wait. I'm so cool. is it is it ran a random person every year or is it 
gonna be that same person. Random person every, every year. Random person every year. You see. So what if that random person tries to kill you, mm-hmm. and you survive, <laughs> and it's another nigga that you don't know? But no, it's one per year. So once you once you stop that one guy, you're good. You're good for the rest of the year. Oh. So you're good. Unless it's like, imagine you stop him at like New Year's Eve, and then the next year you got another nigga. That's the that's way. That's tough. That's that. That's the what are the odds though. What are, what are the odds, odds though? What are <laughs> I the mean, odds, I though? mean, shit. Like maybe. Maybe. And then when I'm older, I'm just gonna be like fucking. Like, yeah, but gr- damn, bro, fifty million for the uh, to put your life in danger every year. Damn. Is that that's that's a that's a pretty low price? <laughs> like, isn't that pretty low? <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I can you can invest some of that bread. You can and make make more that, bread. You make more bread, but shit. I don't know. That's low. That's low. <laughs> yeah. How much you need? How much you need at least? I need at, at least a hundred fifty. A hundred fifty type shit. That's uh, my life. <laughs> the fuck, I need at least a hundred fifty, bro. Oh man, I don't know, bro. I I think I could I could deal with like. Say 500, 100 mil, say 500 mil, untaxed. Type shit. Untaxed. You untaxed, know, yeah. Untaxed. Don't take don't take the bread off I didn't my know about taxes shit. like that. When yeah. I was a kid, then the lottery, oh my God, you want a million dollars. Now you want like 200, 200 K. 200? Maybe like four, 400 K. Yeah, yeah, because they be, they, they be tweaking. It'd be bro. more than 50. They be the tweaking. more money it is, like that. Like, wasn't it like at $2 billion at one point? Yeah, I think so. But I wonder who won that shit. It was $2 billion. Now that nigga what, got what? $1 billion? Yeah. Oh my God. I'm, you and, <laughs> you know what's weird, bro? What? I mean, well, people, people, people do. Uh, I wouldn't niggas wouldn't know, bro. If I mean, I won that. But certain people, states people, you have to like. Oh, give you up have your to tell identity. Them? Yeah, oh. certain states you. I don't know if New Jersey is one of them, but certain states you do gotta give up your identity. That's that's ass. That's what I'm saying. Like niggas just want to get killed. Like what? Like what is wrong with y'all? Yeah, that's crazy. But I'm saying like if I get my bread first, I'm investing into the pod, investing all into the pod. Good. All my everybody gonna be good. Me and Jay gonna be good. My family gonna be good. I don't know if my mom wants to leave this house, but I give her money, whatever she wanna do with that. Shit like that. All my niggas gonna be good. Jay's family's gonna be good. We're gonna be all good, bro. I'm be investing all most of that shit. I'm a, I, first thing I heard you gotta do, you gotta find a lawyer. It's it's like some regular it's like some random lawyer. Somebody that can that I can trust to hold withhold my money. Mm-hmm. Because I heard like there was a person that won in like Florida. Yeah. And like he hired a lady and the lady ended up backstabbing and killing him. Yep. It took all his breath. Yeah. Like he signed some shit. I'm like, yeah. that's OD. Yeah, I seen that too. That's OD. And she, I think she did that to like, like well, she she was. It was like her and her husband like were in on Yeah, it. yeah. They made him sign like, like they made him sign some papers without him knowing about it, like signing his money yeah, it was away. was a black dude, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like I with dreads? I don't, yeah. Free I that nigga, that. bro. Free that nigga, bro. Shit crazy. But all right. What are the questions? Oh, I got another question. And then I have, I have a question and then we have a game. That we could do, and then I have another shit that another story I could talk to you about. So you're being thrown into a deserted island for a month, and you have to survive against this these things for a billion dollars. Which one would you rather be? A horde of zombies, one psycho serial killer, one hungry T Rex, or Freddy Krueger? They say, will say it again. You get a horde of zombies, a psycho serial killer, one hungry T Rex, and Freddy Krueger. And you could pick a weapon to bring with you. I have to kill these niggas? You just have to survive a month. You don't got to kill them. You just got to not die for a whole month on a deserted island. You get not food? Not Freddy Krueger. He goes in my dreams. Hell no. I, I, you can't sleep. Yeah, I can't sleep. Um, You said who else? A, horde t- of, a t- horde of zombies, a psycho serial killer, or a T-Rex? A horde of zombies. Oh, that's what I was going to say. I was going to say zombies. I feel like zombies. zombies would be easy. Zombies would be easier. But? Is it going to be the easiest one out of all of them? But yeah. a horde, how much is a horde? Like fifty to hundred. Woo! But it's a you guys a desert. That's a island. workout. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's a it's workout. A, that's, a, you, that's a lot of hiding. That's a lot of hiding, and but that's like, a desert island. I would not want to. I would stay at the beach as much as possible. Oh yeah. But like that's also not a good thing because like they can they can see me. Like if I get cornered, like Hell where the yeah. fuck I got you can now you gotta go swim around. Oh, and I am yeah, not. That's just that's what I'm I, saying. I go water type shit. That's tough. If it's a serial killer. I can't do the serial killer because if he's OD, he's going to kill me in the first week. Hell yeah. He's going to get me while I'm sleep. T, Hold on now. T-Rex. One T-Rex. You will, you will always know where he's at. Okay, but the weapon. I know. What, like, that's the one What's thing. What's the weapon that's going to really affect that T- T-Rex? <sighs> I don't think there's any weapon, to be honest. <laughs> that's what there's I'm saying. There's nothing. Like, no gun is, was, is killing it that really nigga. is really, like... 
penetrating. Like it's gonna penetrate, but it's not. It's like a sting, my nigga. I just think that since it's so big, pause. Yeah. I would know where it's at most of the time. Yeah. Depending on how big the island so is. So you can survive. So I can survive. I can hear it coming around. I know where it's at. But that's what I'm saying. Just like the zombies. Zombies is like if I can rank it, it would be zombies, T Rex, killer than Freddy Krueger. Yeah, Freddy Krueger is nowhere near. Because I that's that that's, that's too. I wouldn't be that's able to sleep. I can't stay up for three months for yeah, a whole month. I'm that's cool. a crazy word. But I I might do I might fuck around and do the T Rex just cause. I'm gonna do the horde. You gonna do the horde? You gonna try to fuck around and do the horde? Yeah. Okay. Okay. I, I, that's a workout. Bro. I'll do fifty. As long, but like, are you gonna try to hide or are you gonna try to build shelter? Like, what are you gonna try to do? I can't do. I can't build shelter. Shelter. So I gotta hide. You just gonna keep hiding? I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna try to find a cave. To stay in, but not oh, yeah, like yeah, it's a it's an island, right? Yeah, I'm gonna try to find a cave, but I'm not gonna try to. I don't want them to find me because mm-hmm. if they find me, when I'm asleep. I'm done up. Yeah, that's a fact. So that's that's the only the bad part. But oh yeah, I can't just hide. I do gotta sleep. You gotta keep sleeping. You gotta move around. You gotta like set traps and shit. Damn. Yeah, but I think I'll take. I might take the T Rex just because I can hear him. At least if he's he not he's he not gonna be able to creep yeah, up on me. Just one too. So. Just one. But like if he if he sees me, I'm fucked, bro. I'm not you gonna are like, fucked. Like I'm not gonna be able to outrun that motherfucker in the jungle. If I trip and fall, like yeah, no. Nah, but I wanted to talk about like deserted islands because I, I heard a story about um it was in May, right? It was about a group of kids that survived a pra- plane crash in the Amazon and survived forty days. Right? Mm-hmm. So there was a family, right? It was a mother, two pilots, and four kids. The ages were from thirteen or 13 to 15 to 1, right? So they was flying like a little commercial flight above the, across the Amazon to meet their father because their father got ran out of town by like the mob or the gangs or whatever. And something happened where they, they crashed. The two pilots died. They crashed in the jungle. The two pilots died, and the mother died from her injuries like a couple of days after. And the kids were able to survive for 40, 40 days. 40 days? The, kid, like, the oldest one is like 13, 14, 15, whatever. And the youngest is a one-year-old. Nobody died. They survived off of, like, because the grandmother says, like, the oldest one, like, knew about the jungle. So she knew, like, what fruits you can and cannot eat. What the fuck? That's what I'm saying. 13 years old? 13 years old. And she was, like, helping the baby. But, like, that's what I'm saying. Like, and, like, it was weird because they said, like, they sent out search parties to go rescue them. But they couldn't find the kids. But when they found the kids, they weren't that far from the plane. So what the grandmother says is, like, there's a little mythical creature called the duende, duende or whatever. It's like a little. You ever watch Lord of the Rings? No. So Lord of the Rings is basically you. Do you know that you know the the do you little know, uh, hob, the little, little little hobbits? Yeah, it's basically they think it's a little hobbit because in Lord of the Rings, when you put the ring on, you go into another world that the outside world can't see you in. Mm-hmm. So they think that some little creature, whatever, like looked over the kids. And like protected them from like the dangers because you know there's jaguars, yeah, panthers, there's snakes and shit like that. Like them kids should have died within within like a week. High key, especially that one year old. One year old. Come That's on, what I'm girl. saying. So they're thinking that somebody something was looking over them, and like the reason why the the cops couldn't see him or whatever is because like they yeah. were hidden mm. in like some other unworldly thing. So just imagine, bro. We be talking about we can survive shit. These kids survived that shit in 40 days, bro. Yeah, forty days is nuts. And like it's real, like it's real, like that shit happened like a couple months ago. Oh, really? Yeah, it, it was like in, recent. It was like in May. So and it was the Amazon, bro. The damn. Amazon is the worst jungle in the freaking world, bro. God damn. So I don't know, because my my thing is, I don't care how sm- how knowledgeable you are of the jungle, the jungle is unpredictable. It is, bro. There's especially no way, like especially when you are. First of all, they probably got a lot of cuts and stuff because yeah. they got hurt. They get crash landed. There's a lot of infection. They don't mm. got they don't got no medicines. Mm. So it's like, how did they survive that long? Especially the one year old kid. That nigga needs to eat. Yeah, that's a fact. What is he eating? He can't. Oh, just, yeah, what what did they eat? That, like they, little little as um, they said fruits. Fruits, right? But like that she that she they, found that she knew. Yeah, because like was, she knew like the jungle and shit. She knew what to eat and what not to eat. Like what's like good or bad. But it's like, how much fruit can you possibly? Because be finding finding to to help a one year old baby with no with no like animal like coming out of nowhere exactly like, because wherever the food is that's where the animals be at hell yeah that's what and there was four of them she was taking care of 
her three younger siblings. Oh, that is a real nigga. Yo. That that's what I'm saying. That's some real demon, shit. They, they need to make a movie about her. It was tough. Yeah, like what the fuck? I don't know, but that's what the grandmother says. The grandmother thinks that's what happened because there's no way. I don't know if she thinks that she could have done it by herself, but she thinks it was unlikely that nothing bad would happen. It was just her, like, uh, and not only that, that what is that called? The Duende? Duende, yeah, something like that. It's like a little little hobbit. So they think that... It's like a little magical creature or whatever that lives so in the, the jungle. So the reason why they couldn't see them is because they were it's like hidden ma- somewhere else? Yeah, hidden somewhere else. Never know. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know about that, but I, I don't just, know about that one, but... I just think that the kids actually just, like, tweaked. Yeah, she's she just uh, t- like she's just tough. Like, she's bare girls for real, there's bro. There's no reason. Wait, okay, where did they hide? That's what I'm saying. I don't know where they will be at because they brought out like big ass like microphones, like trying to like call out to them, and they never appeared. The I kids said they didn't hear up. it. Yeah, I I sent it to you later if you want yeah, to send it to it. me, bro. That shit crazy work. Yeah, bro. But yeah, bro. It's some weird shit. I don't know. The Amazon, bro, too. Such a crazy. The Amazon, bro. Out of every other place, the Amazon, that's wild, bro. But, dang, bro. You got anything else you want to talk about? Would you be able to survive that shit? Would I be able to survive that shit? 40 days. 40 days. Would not. No, I don't think I. I don't think so. (laughs) Wait, no. Hold on. Let me think. Let me me actually. 40 days, bro. I hate. Out of Amazon. I hate dirt. I hate just the jungle being nasty. Just nasty. The nastiness. Just just, the bugs. uh, Just the bugs. Um, when it rains and shit, like nigga, I'm like terrible when I'm sick, bro. Uh, yeah, I'm a I, bitch when I'm sick. I ain't gonna lie, they hate it, bro. I'm a, baby. I hate, I'm a little, I'm a baby when I'm sick, bro. I get a little cold. I can't breathe that night. Shit hurt, bro. <laughs> nigga, there's be blowing my shit. That that nigga be blowing my shit on the game. Nigga, my back hurt. <laughs> my head hurts. My eyes hurt. Yo, bro, like I just I don't I don't. Forty days. Forty bro. days, bro. It would be the hardest forty days of my life. I ain't gonna lie. You're not making it. You don't Yo, are you making it? Fuck no, nigga. Get to get Me? your will, bro. Where's your will power to live? I just know what I'm good at. Just, I'm just gonna lay over there, bro. And I'm, just and, and defeat. Let it, yes, I will not let the jungle defeat I'm not, me. I'm not bro. gonna. I'm not gonna lay over there. But I'm gonna try to find some. But I don't think I'm making it. I might go crazy. No, like like jungle. You know, jungle fever is a real thing. You, you got to think about it. She knew what to eat and not, uh, not to eat. If I'm hungry, I see some shit. I'm eating it. Pause, bro. <laughs> if that shit look good, I'm eating it. I don't know. That shit gonna be poisonous, and I'm dead. I don't know what I'm gonna That's do. That's how I'm gonna die. All I, see, I watch a lot of survival shows. So you got you got drink. You got drink the water. You can't drink still water. You have to drink running water, like a stream. You got filter out. You know, you gotta do that shit. What it is that or whatever. Creating a trap. That's why I don't know what the fuck I'm gonna do. I don't know. I'm gonna catch You're these motherfucking animals. Trap. I'm gonna have to. I, you gotta create this fucking shelter. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I might find, try to find. How you gonna do that? My shelter is gonna be that, and it's not gonna barricade. It's not gonna. It's not gonna hide the animals neither. My shelter is gonna be the the wreckage. Now I, I don't think I would be. I was gonna say like I'll eat the dead bodies, but I don't think I'll ever go that low. What the actual <laughs> fuck did you say, bro? <laughs> Fritz, you gotta fucking survive. Nah, bro. I would. I ain't gonna lie, bro. I wouldn't do it though. Yeah. I wouldn't, no, I would not do that. I won't do that. I won't do that shit. I would not do that shit. But I would try, bro. I would not do it. But I, what I would do? I'll try to find the radio, or whatever. And like, if there's no signal, I'll try to find. I I'm pretty good with direction, like my sense of direction. So I'll try to like I'm find high land. Directions. I'll try to find high ground and try to get like, you know, signal. Yeah. I'll try. I'll try my best, but. I think I, I think I could try my best to do it. I'm gonna be. I'm like the I, the one thing I'm just afraid of is jungle fever, bro. You know what jungle fever is? Mm-mm. That's when you go you, get go, really you go crazy, you start crazy. hallucinating and shit. Oh, for real? You start that's, seeing that's, shit. That's a real thing. Yeah, that's like when you get like we don't have enough food in your system. You don't mm. have enough nutrients and like water. You just start hallucinating and shit. Mm. I'm not ready for that. I wouldn't. That's why I might croak. I might see like I might fuck around and see Jay. I'm like, oh my gosh, I fall off, <laughs> I fall off a cliff and shit. Now I'm dead. That's that's what might get me. I might get me. Like, yo, I'm here. I found you. Uh, fall to my death. <laughs> that's, that's what might get me. And then Ooh, I, that's funny as fuck. And then I might be like, when I realize, and if I survive that and I realize it wasn't real, I'll get so sad. <laughs> like, fuck, I may never find my way out of here. That's the only, that's the main thing. You just got to have morale, bro. If I was morale high, you could do anything in life. Because if I hallucinated my girl, bro, thinking I'm finally... 
go get some coochie, bro. Nah. He's <laughs> like, nah. They can finally go see somebody. And I fall <laughs> off a cliff and my legs is broke. Somebody come get me and kill me now. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not making it through it mentally. <laughs> That's a, that's a crazy trick your mind do. Yo, mentally? That, no, that's your mind saying like, yeah, we're going to kill yeah, ourselves right now. Yeah, we're done. Like, yeah, we're that's done. Our, that's our mind. You're going like, to yeah, die. You're done, bro. <laughs> you're done. It's over with, bro. We're going to put you out your misery right yeah, now. Yeah, like literally, bro. Like, cause, like, that's so shitty, bro. That's fucked up. Because at that point, bro, once your mind leaves, bro, you're, you done. Get, you're done, bro. You can't make it through anywhere, bro. So honestly, bro, if I fall off a cliff, bro. Hey, bro. It's not even going. It's not even going to be the pain in my legs. That's going to be like, damn. I'm worried about. It's like, damn. Did I really just think that? <laughs> <laughs> and, and I'm, oh, and I'm, and I'm on the ground right this now. This how I'm gonna die. <laughs> like that's really. I could have died from a panther, a jaguar, yeah, like some poison, some, 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 some drowning. Shit. But nah, infection. Nah, I, I died. I from hallucinated. Uh, uh, my girl, <laughs> but <laughs> off a cliff. Like that's ass. <laughs> that easy. <laughs> that easy. Nah, bro. That would be bad, bro. That's ass, bro. Man, oh gosh, bro. But you got anything else you want to talk about, bro? This is a, this is twelve fifty six a.m. It's a le- very Yo, late pod. It's twelve fifty six a.m., bro. It's you know, and I haven't eaten all day. <laughs> I'm starving. You didn't eat today. I had like two two like roll up sandwiches. Wow. What do and, you? What, are and, like, you gonna eat cheese. some? Yeah, I might get some McDonald's. Bad eats. I know bro. you don't like McDonald's. Yo, that Big Mac bus, bro. Bad eats, bro. Wow. Bro, it's twelve o'clock. I hope y'all niggas still. Watching, you know, in tune with the pod, you know what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. If new content coming out. Yeah, new content coming out. If y'all niggas, if y'all niggas made it to here, what time is it? Twelve fifty six. No, like what? Like how many minutes? Hour two, two hours and nine minutes. If y'all niggas made it here, say, happy. tell niggas happy, happy Halloween. Happy Halloween! If, if you made, made this it far, th- this far. I just, hey, thank you again, my brother. Yeah, uh, man. We're pulling up, bro. Yeah, it's been, hey. I'm Darius for today, man. And I'm Fritz. You know, Fritz got Fritz comes on when we when we're falling off. Yeah, bro. Niggas, niggas want me to. Niggas, niggas is using me, bro. Hey, bro. We gotta use Fritz for some content. When we falling hope. off on TikTok, Yo. follow us on TikTok. We're Yo, stop off. telling me. Nigga, just bring every shit out. We falling off, guys. All right, but we falling off. Like that, That's like what that. it is, bro. It's like that. It's like that. But <laughs> thank y'all again, bro. Hope you have a happy Halloween. Tune in on Halloween. We got a special. Adventure vlog with the guys. If you want to see Fritz, yo, in Mortal yo, Terror. <laughs> yo, if y'all want to see me in my Whoop. scary, like my like my form of just horror, bro, my it terrified. Watch the new adventure ep- vlog. adventure vlog, bro. We're gonna do more of those. I well, I don't know I'm if Fritz not, gonna be. I on ain't there. gonna be in the next one or the one after. I ain't gonna be in the scary shit, <laughs> but. F- Look, 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 stay in tune, tune in. bro. Stay in tune. Tune in. We got a lot tune more in stuff. Into the, into the shit, man. We got trivia gonna coming do up. A lot of shit going on. Yeah. Yeah, trivia. Yep. Yeah, I forgot about that. You're going to do trivia. There's a, you know, real good videos, man. Tune I see them, bro. Tune Amazing, into that. Bro. We got some good shit. Good shit, bro. To all my Patreon watchers, I'm sorry we haven't posted in two months. We're not stealing your money, I promise. Yeah. More Patreon episodes will be posted soon. We've just been, you know, things have been a little rocky, midterm school, shit like that. We're just trying to get back into the swing of things and we're just trying to get shit organized you know everybody be busy and shit like that so don't be worry busy bro don't worry shit's gonna come but you got anything else you want to tell the niggas bro i i, I want to tell y'all thank y'all for who's still watching man thank you for supporting man the subscribers the followers the, the patreon members yeah, members man thank y'all for for still being in tune after a year or two years two years of this shit you two know years. what i'm saying we we started this shit two years ago and shit like that going yeah, up day by years. day going up so uh thank y'all for still watching thank y'all for still uh enjoying the enjoying content. the content putting comments down you know interacting with us niggas on the discord you know th- just thank y'all i appreciate it. and happy halloween hope y'all have a safe halloween um, don't do no crazy don't shit. Don't do no stupid shit, bro. No stupid shit because, you know, it get it get crazy, you know what I'm It do saying? get crazy. And just be safe. You know what I'm saying? We different than regular, no regulars, man. Gangsta. We different than no regular, no regulars, man. <laughs> I'm theirs for today, bro. Yeah. Oh, wait, do it, do it, do it. Go ahead. Uh, we, go ahead. we different than... Re- go ahead. We different than regular, no regulars. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we, different, <laughs> we different than regular, regular no, no regulars. regulars. We different, no... Wait. <laughs> <laughs> we, we different than regular, no... 
Wow. Okay. Hold on. <laughs> let me finish. Let me do it. Let me do it. Let me do it. Let me do it. We different. They regular. No regulars. Gangster. Yes, sir. <laughs> I already go get it. I already go get it. I already go get it.